everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome. Come in. Come in. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Hope you're doing all right. Uh, it's Friday the 19th today. Oosh, oosh, oosh. Let's go. Friday, baby. The big... The big day five of the week. And have I got a special treat for you, dear viewer? Uh, um... Uh, because today is an extra long stream, so we're not going to be doing four hours. We're not going to be doing five hours. We, we might be doing six hours. We might even get a seven hour stream in tonight. We'll see how long the caffeine keeps me going. With breaks, of course, uh, to let the doggies out. But otherwise, I've eaten, I'm fed, I'm free. Let's get into game and see what awaits. Oh, my nose. Oh, same old story. Same old story. Itchy nose. I'm going to put my hat on. I've even had a wash. <laughs> That's how much of a special occasion it is. Right, let's get rested up. Hopefully I'm going to get some Ritz done today. Uh, so I'm going to get a level or two. I want to get at least a level. Some sort of lagging behind on the levels. It'd be nice to get a level in. Get some Ritz done, get some gold earned. Um, uh, and then get some role play in later. Obviously, we can't do anything too dastardly right now. So I'm hoping that uh, we can progress the, the Hawkins storyline a little bit, even if it just means you're not coming in here, mate. You know, just to get that answer is fine and I can then pursue other things. If needs be. But let's go ahead and get behoofed. Like, I don't even feel safe getting into disguise in case somebody's scrying me and watches me get into disguise, you know? And so, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play into the, the goody two shoes uh, circle stuff. Hopefully find some opportunities to be a bit a bit devilish and a bit naughty uh, whilst maintaining a good face, you know. Uh, um, uh, but without, like, you know, outing myself as a proper evildoer. We'll see. It's a fine line to walk, that's all I'm going to say. Uh... Cool, this all looks good. Weight looks good. Uh, oh, I've got, I've got some notes. I had to uh, show these to show these notes. We, uh, what was it? We are all being watched. We are working on protection against eyes. Only outer circle business for now. Was the note I had to give somebody. I could also work on my circle stuff as well. Actually, thinking about it, promoting the circle. I need to have a chat with Lady Hexagol, who's a Bainite. I need to definitely find out what she's doing here. Um. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. Hail, friend. Hail, elf friend. Yeah, uh, states with confidence. Hey, first of first of first. <laughs> Is he gonna say anything back? His hand pushes the door. Good to see you. I'm not getting much practice with my elven. It's it's only gone up one percent. I need to go hang out in my own at some point. Hail, townsfolk. 
He beams, he beams with a smile. Oh, Jewin's there, look. Oh, I'm invisible. Yeah, little townsfolk. Shop smart. Our sex call arrives. Are you seeking help with Ritz? Are you trying to find your path on the Isles? Is there a goal or dream that you desire that you or wish people to help with? Or are you just seeking to make coins, slay foes, and earn some glory? House Hexagon offers you aid and all these and more. We are a new house that bases itself around the Dale. Hi, ah, Shan. You've been hiding lately, hmm? Not at all, uh, uh, friend, friend Safir. Uh, I, uh, perhaps we've, uh, we've missed one another in meeting. What's up, dog? Hey, old friend Jewin. Knuckles embrace to the two of you. To the two... To the two of you. <laughs> he smiles wide. Smiles wide. <clears throat> Heading out on Ritz today. Ritz is trying. Zafir. I have items if you wish to sell them at high prices. I ah, perhaps, uh, perhaps I can, perhaps I can offer a wink on your behalf. Hail, Grand Dame. Yeah. Uh, Smiles out towards Mayor. And just in minds with someone named Thomas at Cordor. Oh, Thomas. Interesting name. <laughs> he smiles. What are you doing, dog? Hmm? What are you doing? Hi there. Jesus. Oh, oh look at that. A few interesting, uh, interesting pieces up here. <laughs> he eyes a, uh, a robe. <laughs> Madman's diary. Have fun today, sir. I don't think I'll really play until Sunday, but I might log in every, very late tonight if I'm not too tired. Valentine, don't worry about it, buddy. It's so good to see you. <clears throat> oh, he nods. Uh, my thanks. Yeah, pockets. Pockets a couple of a couple of gems, and folds the robe. Robe up. <laughs> Zaf is a bad guy. He's a bad guy. Or is he? Maybe he's an agent of the uh, the good guys. Although, if you were good, would you hand out those prisms? That smellman's was in Cordor's lastings. That smellman? I'm asking Yishan if he if it was him he mined with. Oh, uh, sorry. Oh, uh, Lord Thomas. He turns to Saphir. Uh, uh, I I uh, I'm unsure of any of any of any lords lords about with such a name. He shrugs. I don't know who Thomas Costamount is. Uh, Ishan doesn't know who Thomas Castamount is. But there's only one Thomas in Cordor, right? Ah, yes, uh, we went to the Dark Realms and the Shadow Realm. Oh! Yes. How, how adventurous! Oh, how, how adventurous! He uh, beams with pride. You know, quite, uh, quite, uh, quite the accomplished, accomplished, uh, uh, defender, defender of the realm. Good friend. Good friend, Safia. Yes, in the city of Cordo, I have many such nobles and lords. 
Yes, that is so. Yes, that is so. I've been meaning to, uh, to head out. Old friend Juin, would you perhaps, excuse me, care to join us for Ritz? I waited to go sailing. <laughs> Why did he send that as a tell? <laughs> Maybe he made a mistake, I don't know. If you have any wishes to do, I will be able to assist. Oh, sorry, no, I'm I'm waiting to go sailing. Fair enough. Fair enough, old friend. Smiles. Smiles and turns to Safia. Well, uh I was thinking about heading heading over to Goldoran to see what uh, what writs they have of their care to join. He, uh, he asks Zafir. Well, very quiet, isn't it? I'll be back to resupply, then we can. Aye, sounds like a good idea. Oh, Hexagol's here, look. Some dirty dark prisms. I need to get some more potions and some scrolls. I'll do that now. Oh my god, there's a bird. Herb. Uh, should we do? Ten bags? Why not? Uh, scribes outside. We'll start with him. Son is Evuno Eberhard. the Fae, isn't it, that's in Yondala's temple. Servant of Yondarla. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One of those... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. Eight of these. <clears throat> I'll buy a few more. Oh, I can take some clarity as well, actually, thinking about it. Look at those. Dirty. Dirty prisms, eh? Maybe, uh, I'm not sure if, I'm not sure if Jewin can make use of those. Still very nice. He's done me a, he's done me a massive favour, old Zafir, hasn't he? Or has he? Is that incriminating evidence? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know whether he's one of the good guys or not. And by good, I mean bad. Well, I get bad guy feelings from him. <clears throat> Buy more. Five more. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Excuse 
Excuse me. Alright, I'll go and spend the rest on shield. you say, eh? Oh, name's Offin. Good to meet you. Uh, Mr. Scroll Boy is right to here. I greet you. Thankfully, shield. Oh, have I just bought a bunch of something else? No, I bought shield. Where's shield gone then? Oh, it's gone there, look. Why are they not stacking? What's going on? Okay. Whatever. Sure. Dog made me jump. What a lovely sound. What a beautiful... Cheers to dogs, everyone. <laughs> Don't get a dog. Should have a word with uh, little little lady Hexagol over here. Shit, priest. Look, bears are in the caves. Yes, it's easy if you just go up there. <coughs> ah, lady Hexagol. My apologies about the uh, <laughs> the rude. Rude manner, manner by which uh, I left you the other tribe. Yeah, he bow, bows his head low. <clears throat> I hope, uh, I hope, uh, I hope uh, uh, such happenings uh, uh, did not leave, did not leave me in poor favour, poor favour with you. Yeah, he smiles with a hopeful, hopeful glint in his eyes. Greetings again, I do not blame you. It would have been rude to make whoever was calling you waste the spell. Ah, a pragmatist. A pragma, pragmatist. Ah, uh, uh, <laughs> it's good to know. We've such, we've such in town. I, I trust you're all you're all settled in. Oh, Zafir, uh, there is nothing to forgive. The same was happened to me before. The fact you felt bad about it and took the time to say sorry for it makes you a good egg in my books. Oh, egg, egg. <laughs> goodly, goodly, I am. <laughs> he pinches his waist. Uh, not so sure. Sure, an egg shapes. He shaped. He shrugs with a laugh. I have started to expand my household and offering help with people's writs. Ah. Oh, is that so? Uh, we, we, uh, uh me, me and uh, my good friend Safir, Safir here are about to undertake. Uh, some writs, most likely out of Gulderand. Would you, would he, would you, um, and your retainers here join us? Yeah, wave Sapphire closer. Come, friend, come. Yes, that is so. 
meet uh, meet uh, Lady Hexagon. <clears throat> you know, I can delay my own work Let's if you wish to help to help on me, lady. Not of my retainers or my men at arms are up at the moment. Bregan here is, however, asking to do some writs with me. He, uh, he spies Bregan. Spies Bregan with a wry... With a wry... Wry one-eyed squint. Master Bregan! Good to meet you. I'm a Shan. To what, uh, to what corner of the aisle do your writs take you? Take you this try. If you are sure, then I will leave you for now. However, if you require aid for the writ, I advise you take someone with you before doing them. That was about me's help with the caves and use can help this twos. Huh? Oh, that also works. Uh oh no, we got a bot. Don't click on that link. There we go, it's gone. I'm just here to lend thy hand. Lend the hand. <laughs> and explode. Explode our enemies. <laughs> he chuckles. You. Huh? He bears down the road. Road of the commotion. Book a friend. Oh, Zan. You're talking to Zan. This one's got to come out. Oh, I've not got streamer mode on. There we go. Uh, I am sure, but thank you for the concern. I will make sure if I find someone to help. Not. Ava, I believe Bregan will be resting here for the time being. Would you wish to come with us to gold? Ah. I'm no weird beast anymore. I can stand here if I wish. Or oh, here again, even. These can... go to Stone's place, yes? Very well, shall we then? We'll build around, I. Should probably get rid of this toll troll thing. Very well, he begins to open a sun port. Don't think I have the, uh... The monastery. I'll meet you by boat. <laughs> I'll meet you by boat. Uh, I can go to the logging grounds, but it's a bit, it's a bit of a run from there. <laughs> Guess I'm going by boat. He chuckles. Oopsie. Let's get some gold. Where's the hidden? Sort of in a rush. Sort of in a rush, uh, Grand Dame. <laughs> yeah, chuckles. 
I can play this all the way up. Aye, that did, that did suit. If you would. My trip to first trip to Goldorand. I'm gonna get yoinked. Yoink. Everybody's having a wonderful Friday. Now is when the problem arises. What problem? How are they going to pull each if they're in a different server? Oh, does Yoink not work across servers? <laughs> Alright, I'll get a move on. At least you can tell them that I'm, uh, I'm on my way. Good, good point. I, I was like, uh, surely Yoink doesn't work across servers. Not to worry. At the very least, May can say he's on his way. He's on his way. I didn't manage. Uh... Everybody just assumes people have got the uh, the portals, don't they? They don't realise that I've been cloistered in Bendir for the last week. Barely scratching any XP. Should hit 22 today. Maybe 23. That'd be nice. If we get a good rit. Good few rits done. But I got nothing but time this weekend. So I'm looking forward to getting a whole bunch of stuff done. I really am. You need to talk to the Amnion down here, right? Hello there. Hello there. Last time I came here, there was a big sign that said plague. <laughs> Not on his hand, though. Day. I've spent some hours in here. Although not quite as many as I've spent in Skull. <laughs> That's for sure. <clears throat> Street urchin. That looks like desync. Is that desync? I'll just reset the game. We all know what it's like.
Calderand. That's the one. Ah, oh, no, it wasn't desync. <laughs> Right, please. Right, that elf looks familiar. Oh, there they are, look, they're all the way over there. Avers come along. Look. What up, Pikers? Hey, crew, there. How's it going? Apply here, the Eagle. This is the Eagle. Greetings from a returning employee, Simon Lavender. Nico Blake, Kurgan Berkers, or Berkers, Simon Lavender. Same one again. That's pretty, pretty recent. Oh, it's Ulrich. Ah, Ulrich. Look, it's a hen. Yucky, yep. Defo a hen. Greetings, friend. Off to do rit work. Rit work this time. Oh. <laughs> hey, holy smokes. Uh, seems I'm, uh, I'm a little, a little lax. Lax in my uh, ley line acquisition. Acquisitions. <laughs> he smiles awkwardly. Ah, uh, greetings. I would get the lay while we're here, Ishan. Uh, I went to the inn, but it is not the quality I'm looking for. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll quickly, quickly nip there now. He nods. See you at the uh, the inn, yes. That's Mayor. Big Doggo. How's it going, Moon? I thought you liked the taste of Hins. Hmm? 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 you. All I've got to say. They taste very sugary. <laughs> and you like the taste of rotting flesh, of course. Right, yes. It all makes sense. Sugary sweet. Yeah, I get it. Oh, well. Hopefully for not much longer. I want to uh, I want to infest Bendir with some uh, much needed corruption. <laughs> Seen that wolf before somewhere. Dog. Just give it a rest. Just give it a rest. There's nothing there. There's nothing of interest outside. Just the blowing of the winds. Vamos! Born in the late 1900s, has joined as a player. Whee! 
good chip. Wow. Looks like Ulrich's busy, so I'm going to leave him with it. Got people waiting on me. I think it's time for some hidden murder, starting with that mayor person. <laughs> uh oh, it's Albert. <laughs> Did you see Albert? Ooh. Right. What's on the ticket today? Uh, no, not me first. Better advice do not do the deep well ones. Chan. Hi. He looks new stuff here. Oh, I recently evolved my abilities as of late. Oh. Uh, his brows raise in interest. Rise with an interested... Uh, his brows rise in interest, whatever. Uh, in what in what manner? When we go to uh, your final task on my list, I'd like to take to test it. Well, there's Albert Lock. Hell, Albert. He's gone. <laughs> Chuckles, you'll see. <laughs> He's gone. I can't find shapeshifters. What to do with shapeshifters? Quiet Shade Haunt. Not that one. Unravel the web. Not that one. Uh, the mug, mug, lulum. Yeah, I'm not seeing that, seeing that either. Neither friend. Something here about a shade haunted ruin. Uh, some uh, some spider infested caves. Uh, and he looks the uh, the offered papers over. Excuse me, good folks. Does anyone know of a good winemaker called Nine the Malgrim, ahem, Grandmaster? Yeah, it might be a bit. To, to, I might be not in the level range for that. I don't know. Being a vampires hmm. in Brogs or Mayors in Dales, maybe. I ah, try, uh, try the Dale, Dale friend Ulrich. Bound to be a brewer, brewer there. Nuts. He turns to the party. Have you taken taken any Ritz, Ritz at all yet? Oh, and there's giant Smee's herds too. Oh yeah, for um, Yord. <sighs> He's only taken one. I'm afraid uh, Zafir, Zafir's uh, skills may may have grown beyond beyond my own. I'm not being offered offered the same the same choices. He shrugs. Good day to you. For God's sake! There's nothing here. There's nothing to bark at. I have, but took upon more. I can take more very soon. All right. Stone Gauntlet. Raid the Knoll Camp. Where's the Knolls? Isn't that like in the forest? The Orcish Threat. Owling Pass. Oh, I've just took a bunch that are like crap, haven't I? They're like really low level ones. Right, 
I'll just take these anyway. Uh, I'm taking a, taking a bunch of crappy writs. Uh, lady, lady Hexagol, take take whatever you wish, and uh, and and we'll join join along. Besides an embarrassment. Yeah, but at least you get them out of the way. Shakes his head. <laughs> yeah, I Zafir, Zafir with a serious squint. <laughs> Before the usual smile breaks his lips. <laughs> Silly old me. So you go to better ones. Fastest one to do. Just need to clear some crypts. <laughs> Doesn't that lead down into the into the? Uh, oh, not crypts. Crypts. Oh, size. I'm dead. <laughs> Chuckles. Gather around. Here we go. They make good, good chew toys. Or of enmity. What does that do? She come in with us or not? Or she say good luck to the other guy? Uh, probably. I <laughs> summoning in the town. Oopsie. We might come and put a stop to that. Might do. Spells that I got for fighting uh, I'm dead. Not much. Can't make them dance. Can't affect their minds. Shadow shield. I don't. I don't cast that enough, you know. slow them at the very least. <clears throat> Death to the enemy! It's Velasco! Isn't he a Bellite now? Is what I'd heard. Don't take, don't take my word for it. <laughs> this is a bit too epic. A bit too epic. Remove. Next. A little bit too epic for me, that one. Is this towards the crypts? 
Oh, it's in the... Uh, isn't there another way down there through... Uh, into over here? Oh, well, whatever. Oh, that AC. That tasty AC, baby. Talking about the Weatherstone. It's under this building? It is? Ah. The uh, Ponders. They put they brought the weatherstone here. Is that part of the quest? Or well, the event, sorry, not quest. Yeah, but at least you get them out of the way. Oh, sorry, I've already read that. <laughs> I think Hex Lady Hexagon knows where she's going. Come on. You can do it. transition mechanics is this the way I'm not sure this is the way right or have they changed this yeah it's uh it's over here in the north exit bless <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh well, I don't know actually. What is going on? Am I just blind? Where? I, 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 my character doesn't know where they're going, so I kind of have to just follow. <laughs> I guess. I didn't know about this way through, though. I always thought you had to go up those, like, stairs. Not knowing you could go up here and then through the north exit. Hexagon's got some property that we need to talk about. He is. Oh. Finally, this mix. Alright, let's go. Go 
got some nice AC. Uh, who's collecting everyone okay if I carried? Sounds good to me. Jesus. Oh yeah, we're not going to struggle with this, are we? Where did all the wolves come from? Light, light work. <laughs> he chuckles. He chuckles. Smoke, smoke and smoke and embers. Uh, billow, billow off, off the corpses nearby. He's like light, light work. Slaps his forehead. <laughs> Not that one. <clears throat> oh, hard wilting incoming. Annoying. You wouldn't know it was annoying because you're frozen in time. You would see you would see him as we blinking very fast. So fast. You cast that that horrid cloud. Cloud in an instant. You sound shocked. Undead, don't we all? Whew. You and me both. Monkey, look away. Chuffing hell, he's just blowing the doors down. <laughs> oh my god, the lag! Wrong boat, wrong route. Uh, you property on the aisle, uh, Lady Hexagal. Hexagal. Explodes enemies also with Shan. Only casts. Only casts slow. That's all I can cast on these things. I could cast Eldritch Blast, but I'm not going to. Because I'm not stupid. <laughs> Anybody could be watching. Oh, there it is. Oh. Maybe I can wang a... Uh Oh, I, I can get a thingy, can't I? That's it. What you call it? Where is it? Ice storm. What ice storm in? At least I can cast that every once in a while. I can't use that. Can 
can use that though. Uh, yeah, all good. He smiles. Too extreme, that one. Alright. A lot of puppies. Yeah, yeah, lots. Lots and lots of puppies. something useful don't worry I could throw oh I've got I'm casting freeze <clears throat> but yeah the uh, big spell every now and again it's a good idea I mean I don't want I just don't want to eldritch blast is warlock confirmed everything else is Maybe, maybe not, you know? And slow's a useful spell anyway. Don't, don't at me, brah. Spell is, slow is a useful spell. Just doesn't do the damage. I like playing Shifter, actually, so you can spam Ice Storms and you're immune to them yourself. I'm in favour with you play it safe until you know you're in a good position. I have no way of knowing who might be watching. Oof, rough luck. Yeah, in, in game. I'm probably being scried right now. Jesus. <laughs> it just smashes those doors down. He nods impressed. Elementalists are, do just put the uh, put the power down, don't they? I don't need to cast any spells. I'm just I'm just arm candy at this point. Problem is with that um, freeze ability is it makes them immune to cold. And it's quite annoying. I'll just sort that out for that actually. Punch hard, he he's. Anyone got it locks? Right now. At least I've got the knock knock scrolls. I should have bought. I should buy some of those. Summon's come. 
They're not that expensive either, are they, really? Good seeing a Shanna around again. Been a while. Can't do this while you're in combat. Hi, likewise. Up all as well. we're getting some good XP. Oh, she's turned into a uh, elemental. Oh, I'll check the bookcase if you don't want to. Imagine being immune to this to a spell you can only cast each three minutes. <laughs> playing shifter rakshasha i don't even get what that means rakshashas uh, shift rakshashas are already shifters what do you mean the class shifter is that right don't you have to have a uh, thingy to play that have you played a rakshasa duke since when Flash shifter can turn into some sort of homemade Rakshasa. Oh, I see. Right, okay. So you can take the form of a Rakshasa, but you're not actually a Rakshasa. Got it. Oof. These catacombs... Oh, those are an awful maze. Oh my god, they're all dead. I'll cast my one cantrip. Take that. Did you see me take him down? Did you see him see me hit him? Uh is this one a bit is this one a bit also is this one a bit epic? Uh we've already we've already got to the end of it anyway. It's a little bit too epic this one, isn't it? Oh well. I've got no no sense of the rhyme or reason of what we're doing and why we're just running through this dungeon at the moment, ain't we? Ooh, look at all that AC. Very nice. Is it the end or just the start of another epic adventure? <laughs> it was the end of that song. Whew. Another, uh, another shambler, another set of shamblers, set of shamblers. Put back to rest. He nods, he nods with the, uh, with approval. friends uh, I need a I need a minute to catch my breath chuckles for some run I need the ash lord dead and eight more under the keep
hops up. <clears throat> oh, right, well. What's next? Further further down? We seem safe enough. <laughs> he laughs out loud. In this form me can't me can't cast. He looks up, looks up at Ava. That's quite an impressive impressive feat, friend. <laughs> I believe it is somewhat uh, but I'm still looking for the Ash Lord too. Jacqueline Hexago. Skeleton is dead. Just too, too easy for these guys, anyway. Crap, Sestu Four. I do like the smashing of the doors. Kind of cool. Huh? He's dead. Seem, seem, seem well rested. <laughs> Thankfully, I believe the Ash Lord is under the state building. the gods I'll just watch <laughs> stairs down Does that lead down to the wells you don't want to go down there. Steps leading down. Ah. Let's not go down there. You peers, peers between between the uh, the planks nothing but a pitch black yes, there's a ladder so. there's a ladder could climb down into the hole Don't trust the bird man, he's with them. Hey, Fuzzy, how's it going? Who's them, you ask? Just them. How's it going, you all right? You crazy old coot. Hacks, I know, I... You don't know me. <laughs> I know you now, do I? Is this it? Are we friends? Snake, snake redeem. Friendos. Say the thing. Oh, I'm a snake. I'm a slithery slathery snake. I'm gonna be slithery slathering around. I'm a snake. <laughs> oh dear. We believe in you. <laughs> he chuckles. I'm a snake. <laughs> Thank you very much for that snake redeem. I really need to put those in there. Oh, we're getting into the, 
this is where the birdman is, right? Yeah, the birdman's down here. No, yes, yes, no. No, we're in the catacombs again now. I feel like this has changed. Maybe it hasn't, I don't know. Check the doors at least, she huffs. Is there a lock? Uh, I'll drop this on him. Oh, can't cast that there. Can't cast it there, though, right? Oh, did I just die? <laughs> Oopsie. What got me? I just get. I just got KO'd. Yeah, yeah. Save or die. Lord of Ash is horrible. I've never had any problems with him, really. Oh, he's kicking ass now, though. He's dead. <laughs> Nasty bleeder, that one. The vines got you. Did I cast the vines? I don't think I did. Ah, doesn't matter if I did anyway. You do be a bit of a prick. Green's vine. Green's vine, good. She carefully tries to unwrap the vines to get Safia free. <laughs> well, one minute, 15 sec. Come on, lad, get up. <laughs> he looks a little punch drunk. <laughs> he chuckles. Look, his eyes are crossed. <laughs> he got hit with a um, fist thing, didn't he? <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> I keeps trying to help Safir. There we go. Ah, there we go. Reaches thanks to you. Can't wait to come and do that all again. <laughs> well, that was a that was a fight, wasn't it? Sounds shocked. Uh, 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 we made made swift work, swift work of all the others. Hey, Ash, how's it going? I'm a snake. I'm talking about eels, boy. Eels up inside ya, find it an entrance where they can. Eels up inside ya, find it an entrance where they can. Boring for your mind, for your tummy, for your anus, eels. <clears throat> I'm doing alright, mate, yeah. Eels, boy. Hey, Elwood, how's it going? I was obsolete. I couldn't hear a beat staggering about on me old two feet out one foot in the grave. Now the rave, now the rave, 
It's a mashup. Yeah, mashup. Elements of the past. And elements of the future. Are coming at ya. I'm the itcha. Let me put you in the picture. Eels up inside ya. Finding an entrance where they can. Eels up inside ya. Finding an entrance where they can. Oh, yeah. Well enough. <laughs> right, to the keep then. Beautiful, brought a tear to my eye, dude. Crippity, crippity, crimp, but fuck you. <laughs> I like a good crimp as well. Maybe another way. To the keep. I did a twisty, ooh, ah, ooh, a little twisty. My sister and I used to know them all and do them all the time, uh, good old days. <laughs> I don't know them all that well, if I'm honest. But I know a few. If you would like to regale them for us, uh, I would be more than happy to hear. It's surprising to know that Boosh is out there. I, I, I imagine you're uh, US, right? Given your time zone, from what I could tell. I just need to kill a few here. Ah, let's have a let's have them. Put these baggers, baggers to rest. I say, I reckon. Gods, I wish I remembered that. That was a long time ago. We're in Canada and even went to see Noel and the gang live. But we're also from a British family. We were first gen born here. Ah, okay. So you've got uh, you've got the BBC in your blood, basically. <laughs> ooh, ah, ooh, I did a twisty. Can't get him from here. Whee! Exactly, it was full on Xmas 2, Queen's Address and all that. Alright, well, I, I never bother with that. <laughs> I'm from North. Don't, don't give a fuck about Queen's Address. Uh, but I guess if all you've got is the BBC, then uh, sure. <laughs> the World Service, or whatever it's called. That's the news, I guess. Oh my god! Run! It's gonna hurt! <laughs> oh, 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 that looks nasty! Nose move! <laughs> Hold on! Anyways, pay attention before you die. I'm alive. I'm alive. Oh, look, there's a dead body here. Look. <laughs> Ooh, quick. Toxic baby. I didn't even know that. That's a new one. That Have they changed this. It feels new. By the gods. Ava, when you get back, can you take a look at my helmet? It's falling to pieces. Oh, we have a smith. Smith with us. He smiles at Ava. Hey, Thalantir, cause you know that I'm toxic. Oh, uh, and Thalantir did the, uh, the F in chat. 
<laughs> A book explodes in his face. <laughs> Explosive books. This place is a death trap. Yes, that is so. <laughs> Why did he say it there? Oh, if I, if I. Oh, there we go. Can't get that way, look. We still need to kill there. Well, let's keep moving. Oh, God. There's part of me that whenever I feel the need... Up. Come on. Pardon me that whenever I need to make a character with an accent wants to make Jar Jar Binks, I know it would be stupid. I don't know why I'm like this. We's are gonna die. I don't know. Isn't there like strange, like racial connotations to Jar Jar Binks? I mean, I don't know, but I know there's a little bit of controversy about his accent. Jeez. Oh, that'll be fine. Do it. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I just... Yeah. Everything is racist if you try hard enough. I'd say, well, yeah, maybe. Two more. The music's been great. Apart from those odd songs that we've had to... had to skip. It's been pretty good to die. The list has been on fire. I can't even, like, cast a spell. There we go. I got one in. There we go. I cast a spell. done thankfully Ooh, he breathes a sigh of relief all right let's get out get out without being without without being dissolved in acid misa looks for blacksmith used to be a black yeah <laughs> that's not good <laughs> Average goblin RP. Actually, that's a very good point. We have a gobbo that speaks in a similar fashion, yeah. <laughs> Elwood, uh, Elwood plays uh, Truckup, by the way. That dastardly queen. That um, uh, pulled out uh, Ming's, Ming's teeth. I'll get you for that. You'll pay. You'll pay. Means is Smith, but knows knows master one. She's doing it. <sighs> can't wait for his retribution arc. I uh, can't be asked to play Ming. He's bored. He's done. But aside from showing up for some event that you want him to show up for for one evening or whatever or a couple of evenings he's done you know I don't see me playing Ming
He was fun for what it Ming and Garn take on Skarl. <laughs> oh man, Garn was a very popular one. Thank you very much. It was a group effort. Oh, who said props Al would well played? It was a group effort. I had many other people working with me on it and doing their own tasks. Oh, we had fun with him. And he's always welcome back, uh, of course. Of course he is! <clears throat> of course, of course. Wasn't all skin I was telling. <laughs> of course, fuck it, of course. I wasn't asking. I was telling. If I want to come back, I'll come back you back. Alright. Um uh, well, I'm knocking things over. Uh what was I was gonna say. It was fun. It was fun to play for a couple of weeks. Well <sighs> We've got a long way to go with the Shan, obviously. Uh and the circles plot. And then on top of that, uh, I think we're bringing the Majocracy back when, uh, oh, when the Circles plot's done. Seems to be a very popular uh, 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 ask. Long last the Majocracy! Uh, yeah, the Majocracy was very popular. I, it would be cool to bring the Majocracy back around about October time, which is when we did the last Majocracy plot. So it'd been like a nice year-long anniversary, you know? Uh, a year, the year anniversary from the original plot. Uh, so it'd be three years in game. So that would be cool. Uh, <clears throat> I'll be sure sure to come come see you for for any for any work I need, uh, Lady Ava. I'll send her a little a little thank you. Yes, the legalized necromancy. Oh yeah, well not even legalized, just force. Necromancy. We're the majocracy, and we know what's best for you, right, plebeian? We're the smart ones, you're the dumb ones. Sit down, shut up, and do what we say. <laughs> we have nothing, nothing but your best interests at heart. Uh, it's going to be a harder sell than the original necromancy plot. <laughs> Which uh, was pretty easy. But we could uh, dress it up as... Um, you know, well, we're here to rest the spirits of Kurgan, but really we're, we're, we're here to, to do something dastardly. Could be a way. Not really. Join us or die or... Join us or die and join us. Yeah. If only arrow lift worked like that, right? It would be cool. I always enjoy a good scowl plot. The, 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 the time of a scowl plot is is perfect for me like it's it's a month it's about a month you spend two weeks getting to level 19 and then the, the last two weeks pushing your plot and then you die and never come back again i think it'd be more useful as a sack of meat than a sack of meat with sentience it just writes itself see <laughs> I always thought the deep center pit in Kurgan could be used as a plot point. Bone dragon sleeping in the pit or something. Oh, there's the, um... 
there's that dragon lich thing as well up on the knoll hill right oh bone wing that's it <clears throat> We could do something with that. Dark rituals. I can just imagine us all in our dark black robes, necromancer robes, wandering around in disguise, hissing at people. Lady <laughs> Avery. That's new. Oh, are you a are you a retainer of uh, of of Lady? Exegals. Yeah, what the heck is that ash here? There's just a dead bone wing chilling. Yeah, it's bone wing. He's a Draco Lich. Yeah, that's right. He summoned a bunch of demons and the people of Skull had to go and fight him. Yeah, he was active just before the Majocracy plot. Exactly. Yeah, he was. Uh, it was a Titania. Is it Titania or Titania? Answers in the comments below. Or at the side. Answer in the comments up here. Um. Yeah, there was a. There was a whole big thing. I can't remember. I don't know what the exact details of that were. Uh, because I didn't get involved in solving the bone wing mystery oh what a spell look at that thing wow big smacks wow holy crap i think it kicks ass did you just hit me Tay T Tai Titania. Yeah. Tai. It's Tai. Titania. It's like Titanania. Titania. Yeah. I don't know why I'm struggling with that. Titania. Running around the druids with life aura. Ew. Is that what's going on here? Maybe they're bad druids. Oh, I, I hit my, my good friend. I'm hit! I'm hit! Druids are buggered now, anyway, aren't they? Uh, they've, they've been de-shambled. De-fungus shambled. All this undead, I'll bet some positive energy would do wonders. <laughs> Ooh. Tough punch there. I'm ironically probably the best healer in the group. <laughs> probably. What a shame. Shackled by society once more. Yeah, that's right. But not for much longer. <clears throat> we'll get out eventually. It won't be long until we're 30 and laughing all the way to the uh, to the bank. Ooh, what's the spider? Yeah, imagine getting to 30 in like a week. Imagine getting to 30 in a week. <laughs> From level uh, 19. 
Nobody could do that. LA Hammer is such a cool looking spell. Uh, I don't know which one those were. I didn't see. I don't even think I've got all my rings on properly, so maybe I should sort that out. That's the big pillar of light. Right, okay. That's what he's doing, yeah. Doing an empowered, uh... Or, yeah, they're empowered, aren't they? Empowered flame walls and shit. Really cool. I don't have to pick anything up either, which is nice. All right, we're getting out of here. Oh my god, so many! They made them fun, yeah. I thought they'd been nerfed, though. People were saying they've been nerfed. Dead. Getting a bit chilly in here. Oh. Oh. Put some socks on in a minute. Oh, just a moment, friends. I need to sit. All right, I'm just going to quickly uh, put my clothes on. What are you looking at? Put your eyes back in. <laughs> Jacqueline is heavily cursed. Cursed? Oh, what have I done? Oh no. There we go. No, 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 no. Oh, there we go. She better? Right. Best, uh, best get the spoils to the merchants, eh? get you to your share. Are uh, you sure you don't want anything either? I love seeing these connections that Shan is making. I'm just going out on a rip with them if I'm honest with you. Uh, but, you know, we know she's a Bainite, so... You fought exceptionally bravery. Exceptionally brave. Bravely. Uh, Lady, Lady Hexagal. Hexagal. A true, true paragon. Paragon of the community. Nods with approval. You rushed, rushed into battle with nary, nary a thought. I tried to fight from the front for your own, for your own, own hide. <clears throat> Playing the shield, shield to all of us. Well done. <laughs> I'll blow some smoke up your ass. She did actually fight really well, but... <clears throat> some thought I'm not a fool enough to stay there if I'm about to die doing it. <clears throat> he shrugs, he chuckles. 
Aye, but danger you faced. Most of the time, if I can handle it, I, I trust everyone can pull me out of the shit. Oops. Uh, I jumped into, then I will stay and fight. We've just had the big telling off about naughty curse words. Don't worry, I won't let you die, says Zafir. Zafir has... Uh, Zafir also uh, made light, light, light and crispy work. Work of the enemies. <laughs> uh, I need to blow some smoke up there, either. That's their one curse for the year now, is it? I thought it was one, once a month. Obviously, we all know it's not once a month anymore. <clears throat> and Ava, with her, uh, with her patience, patience, and watching me, watching me, uh, watching me bring up the rear. <laughs> Chuckles. Apologies. For dragging my feet. Ugh. God. Hate being nice. Hate it. I hate being nice when it's not obvious I'm being duplicitous. All's about the smells. They've become the land they protect. stakes the get about trading coaster you did your part the same as as us all oh he beams with a wide smile you're too kind I'm just truthful. If you had messed up, I would have pointed it out. Oh. Not one to mince words. I, uh, I can appreciate, appreciate that. Is she a harbinger, or was she something else? I didn't, I didn't quite catch how she fought. Did anybody catch how she fought? I was more. All I could see was Zafir just blap, blapping things with his spells. Um, and obviously I'm like waxing lyrical for the sake of the uh, stream. prefer to be out of here as soon as possible. Out of gold? Gold around? Dee -dee 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 -dee. History here? He asks... 
he asked with a questioning questioning tone. Timothy. Timothy Pondhopper. Bailin Larandal. 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 Last time I was in this building, I got divorced and lost a finger. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> it shakes his head. How troublesome. What's she giving me? Five bags? Uh, you've never, never sold, sold a thing yet. Yeah, he asks with a, with a, with a, with a. Comes over holding out a bag of coin. You're buying me off with five bags, are you? I haven't. Still, I will pay you this at least. Oh, whatever. Ah, that suits, I guess. Casual shrug, shrug. As he uh, pockets, pockets the coin. You work with me, you get five bags at least. Oh, okay. What? Ah. Okay. Interesting. Uh, a true and noble, noble generosity. Generosity. Noble General General City. Yeah, he, uh, he admits. I don't know why I can't spell generosity. Did I do it right? Not quite. <laughs> I miss, missed up the O and the E. Both of my other writs are at the school crags. Have you the Weatherstone lay? I don't. He admits. Again. Professional curiosity. Uh, does she mean courtesy? Well, then we travel. You've uh, your business up up in that uh, up in that region. He, he fires the question towards Sapphire. We now we're doing on XP. Yeah, I guess we could go and do some more adventuring. Once it's done, it's done, right? How much do you have, Ishan? We should do one of yours next. Oh, something about some spiders and uh, and a shadow, shadow-infested ruin. He shrugs. He uh, pats the papers at his waist. Uh, nothing I I can't handle handle uh, when there's when there's uh, when there's time. Invisible. He's no good against shadows, things, says Ava. Oh, it's Al. The Winter Guard.
Meet me to thine gate, ahem. Meet me at thine gate. I must go and uh, get her the, uh, the appraise bonus, unless she's got it herself. I guess we'll see. Oh, she's at the Eagle. Am I blind? Okay, now they've left. Look at this boy, Jermaine. Cool, cool armor, bro. Cool armor indeed. <clears throat> Wee. She gonna go in here? I don't even know where she's going. All right, okay, she's got it, she's got it. <laughs> There's something a bit off about Lady Hexagol. I don't... I feel like she feels old, but also new at the same time. Very strange. Almost like she might be a returning player, maybe? about better prices. It's a shame. <laughs> Bonjour. Bonjour. Am I not giving a... I guess not. I'm not a fan of Gregorian chant. I'm going to take that one out. Hope everybody's having a nice Friday. You having a good one? I'm having a good one. <clears throat> I was supposed to go to the gym today, but I thought... Ah, my legs genuinely hurt today. After uh, I've done... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Seven... Uh, at least two and a half mile dog walks. But I've actually done more than that in five days. So I've done more multiple multiple walks on Tuesday and uh, Thursday, so yesterday, and two two-hour elliptical sessions. Uh, no, three. Is it three? I think I did a session on. It was last weekend, wasn't it? Yeah. So I've done two ses two sessions on the cardio this week. I'm gonna do another one tomorrow. <clears throat> she gone out. She's gone out. Trying to get on uh, on top of the old weight situation. Wait. Ember Fang. It's like Will. Sorry, the another day I was busy. Greetings, friend. Next. 
I have something to do right now, but I could catch up later. As you wish, so waif. Wolf. He smirks. I really enjoy that that attire, friend. Now if you excuse me, I need to get the pike out of this city. Oh, we're off. Kind of cool. I like this this uh, get up she's got the gold. Pretty cool. We. Adventure awaits. Oh, to be on the road again, to be on the road again. So what adventure adventures do we do we stroll today, this day? To the top of a mountain. to the very depths, depths of the earth. To the mountain! <laughs> Suits me. I hate the underground. <laughs> he chuckles. Not yet to the depths, however, says Zafir. Next time, the plane of ice. Oh, I think you'd do well there. Fight! Now I can do something. Fogs from below. You're below the plane of the fog, you don't get any render look. Interesting. Didn't know that. I guess that's. I'm only, I'm only just finding that out because this is the, the shortest I've ever been in game.
Nobody collecting the goods? Oh no, she's there. This is a good song, I know this one. Among the White Clouds. That's what it's called. She's rejected. Fancy seeing you here, eh? Fancy that. Race mix. <laughs> you coming along? We're we're heading we're heading heading uh, to the mountains. Oh my may, I'm just on my way to the city, she offers a firm nod. They've travels. And circle circles embrace. Just spotted. Just catching up. Catching up with Cam. Cam on the road. Nice. Sneaky one with your invisibility. Don't blame a hen. Blame a hen for hiding its hide. I don't fancy being being made made into into giant giant smush. Many things, friend, friend Sapphire. <laughs> he chuckles. Sapphire's asking hard questions. Oh my god, they're all dead. Shield up. I never put that coin in the bank, actually. That's a silly move. Mind you, we, we don't seem to be struggling, do we? Everything just dies. <clears throat> it's 
takes that little little chance against our might. Yeah, uh, affirms. Oh, he's immune to that, is he? Slap him. Slap him with the old stickeroo. o'clock I'll probably do this one one last rate and then let the dogs out get back to Ben Deer and do some role play this is where I walked all the way from to from the Dale. <laughs> he chuckles. The Dale feels, feels far away from this place. Quite, quite a jog, aye. Eh? Well, which is it? Is that fair? A walk or a jog? I guess a bit of both. sure to get the lay here. Uh, what plans uh, do you harbour? Harbour for the Dale. For the Dale, then, uh, then la Lady Hexagal. You dine way, says uh, Safir. It's more for the entire aisle. Oh, I, I thought you, uh, I thought you, making residence in Bendir. But I see your ambitions, ambitions. I further afield. Not impressed. Hey, come on, run! God damn it! Team. Oopsie. I'm yawning again. Stop it. I'm trying to form a mercenary house. Ah! Oh, excellent. Oh, excellent. No doubt uh, uh, a lot of good can be done by, by such. Greetings, old friend. A 
What's his name? Oh well. Well, so this way. Uh, hold on. Uh, he peers, peers up at the mountains. It's like quite, quite a, quite a uh, climb. Either of you interested in becoming a retainer? Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> my schedule is rather, rather full, full at the moment. Oh, I'm keen to hear more of your plans. Uh, come on, run, pathfind. Where's she gone? There she is. I'm joining the Hawking. <laughs> And uh, I, I have my own, my own uh, uh, circle, circle of friends to, to look out for at the moment. He admits. Hi. He nods to uh, Safia. What does that mean for the circle? Nothing, friend. The circle, circle shall remain. We each must find find our place place in the place on the aisle. You just get paid to do jobs with me, and on the list of names I call upon with needed, you can always say no. In which case, I might. I see, I thought you wanted a, a joint alliance. <clears throat> oh no, uh, I don't believe believe the Hawkin are, are in the uh, the business of uh, making alliances with mercenary groups, uh, with with civil groups such as ours. my service service as a member of the circle shall be offered for the betterment betterment of Bendir you should consider joining yourself friend I did a, I did a ice storm, baby. Yes, our circle uh, will still, still be growing. I'll be looking for. Uh, people to join join our support network support network and uh, pushing pushing our pushing uh, and lending lending our aid where it's needed needed most come on keep going We've got to get into the Bendir Dale. Theron, Cass, and L, for example, are working working on the farm. Uh, 
I fare better in a human settlement. <laughs> uh, this suit's fine. Smiles. Quarter on gold or uh, something. Pants. Pants a little. Oh, this blasted hill. I had plans in making a custom home in the plane of fire. <laughs> See a fire galassi. <laughs> that sounds like a like a very very sapphire thing thing to do. He <laughs> smirks. Almost died here once. Still have the scars on my back. Odds of other darkers. Gulps. You should be fine. Gulp and swallow. Classic as sham. Is it? It's very hidden, hidden behavior, isn't it? You know what I mean? <sighs> Cracks. Yeah, waves his arms about about the portal energies. Pulsating, pulsating ripples of yellow mesh and absorb, mesh and and, and entwine with his with his arm. Extend jaws like a goblin shark. Gulp. Ah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a goblin shark. What now, friends? <laughs> like a goblin shark. That is, uh, that is the way it was. Tell have Ritz, what are yours, Asham? Oh, uh, uh, something about something about spiders and shadows. Uh, shadows, he shrugs. Uh, but I'm I'm do I'm do a half an hour, half an hour break. He sighs. These old legs, tisk. Just not what they used to be. Used to be. I have food coming soon. Uh, I need to let the dogs out, etc. Get a coffee. <laughs> Woo lets the dogs out. Woo lets the dogs out. Well, both of my writs are in the school crags. Perhaps best we uh, part ways for now. Uh, you seem seem plenty capable. Smiles. Brings you two. <laughs> yeah. Throws a a an, allu an illusionary an illusionary wave. Hey, 
Tilds are goated, though. Such a nice flourish to a sentence. Oh, that's the ellipses. Oh, that's me then, yeah? Where did I, what did I type? My, my. Oh, something about spiders and shadows, dot, 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 he shrugs. But I'm due a half an hour break, he sighs. These old legs, a tusk. Just not where they used to be. That's to say, not finished. Stick in your remote. Something else is going to continue from here. Nothing wrong with that. It's a beautiful bit of bit of writing. Sorry, but that's that's advanced role play. Thank you very much. Don't mind me. Just wondering. I'll take whatever you, where you don't. Seems like you have a crowd. All right, offer. <clears throat> Walking badge. Hi. Right, well. <laughs> I'm uh, I'm about to uh, I'm about to uh, take a break and enjoy the view. That's what a tilde's for, for cutting off a sentence. A uh, tilde is an interruption, usually. Da 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 da. Tilde, I stop. I've been interrupted. It's a It's a. It's the. Again, unless you want everyone on the aisle to want your head, do not touch the stone. Use the tilt for inflection. Yeah. Well, I always seen it used the uh, as a as a true words, true words. Thank you for your aid. My right, thanks, Lady Hexagal, Hexagal and friend. Circles embrace friends. You make it a bit fruity. I wouldn't say that. <laughs> See, I put little little quotations around things for that sort of stuff. All right, ladies and gents, welcome, welcome, welcome. Come in, come in. It's Friday. Come into my little lair. <laughs> I'm doing the sexy face and the sexy voice, right? Hello there, come in. Um, <laughs> I need to go let the dogs out, get a cup of coffee, maybe a little, little, little snacky, little snacky snack, or two, if there are any. Maybe I'll get an apple. Uh, but in the meantime, enjoy this wonderful dirge that's playing. Oh, not eating dwarfs. <laughs> a little, a little snacky snack. Uh, this dirge is called Open Season by Weary Pines. I love this song. I'll def use, I definitely use them to be zesty, says Asher, for the tilts, yeah. This song is great. You like this one? It is a good one, this one. It's, it's very horror-themed, isn't it? I can't stop, can I? <laughs> Alright, that's enough of that. I'll be right back. Enjoy the dirge. Uh, after that, you've got Ancient Caves, which is another good one. I'll see you in five.
Hello there, dear viewer. <laughs> it is I. T Hax 18. Hello, everyone. Um, what little cheesy bites, look. I've got little bites of cheese. Oh. I've got an apple. Because we all know apple means evil, right? Duke uh, figured it all out. <laughs> the, do the dogs did go poo. Thanks for that, phase. <laughs> they went outside. They're here now begging for cheese. Which, I've got to be honest, if I was a dog, I would also beg for cheese. Hey, Cap's here as well. Hello, welcome. Come in, come in, come in, friends. <laughs> welcome to my lair. I'm just gonna shake this. This is this is a protein shaker. <sighs> All right. And the seven dwarfs? Eh? Yeah. Ah. Little cheesy nibbly bits. Oh, I've also got a cup of coffee. So I've got all, a bunch of random things. Little cheesy niblets. An apple. A protein shake. And. A half eaten slice of toast. I don't know what you're thinking, Cap. Uh, what's this in reference to? Something I just said? Touche, friend. Touche. Gotta watch out for that cab, everyone. <laughs> guy knows oh the apple oh now it makes sense That was the poison apple. No, what Duke said was uh, it's a cinema sin that the bad guy eats an apple. A cinema sin, or what we call a TV trope. Where the bad guy eats an, a piece of an apple while he philosophizes about why evil's required. an apple while he's talking to the to the good guys to kind of show that he's more interested in his snack than he is the importance of his guest I'm assuming so dear I'm gonna go find out now hopefully Uh, there's a question mark on that join join the hawking so you might have missed the question mark in the title <laughs> cheers everyone oh yeah that's good that's good. That's a good cup of joe. Alright, let's see what's going on up ahead. I need to put some money in the bank. Spruce. That's a fay, right? He waves at Exo. There's Exo. Look, there he is. Oh, Bella's there, look. Hey, old townsfolk. Beams with a wide smile. Hello there. Hello there. Sarah waves lightly. 
<laughs> uh, a his eyes press press into a squint into a tight 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 but friendly squint feeling better today sarah she was very grumpy the other day uh sarah shrugs her shoulders eh. she looks to bella any news on the application? On the application? They should mom, mom hook. Can't wait to get animal speech. I'm missing out on so much. These bloody druids. Honestly, sometimes I like to think of the philosophies like the tried and true. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger or blessings in disguise. Hawking uh, for the Hawking cap. To join the uh, the civil the civil defence force, the militia. Apparently, Sarah cannot respond. The question was uh, was for was for Bella. Smiles. AFK. Well, when she's done daydreaming, uh, uh, we are approving it. Uh, I'll keep an eye out eye out for uh, for any news then yeah he winks before throwing his arms out wide circles embrace friends he whistles a jaunty tune uh, a, a, a joyful joyful tune La, 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 God, I hate being good. Ugh. Gotta get some action, man. I need to, I need to murder someone, you know, or just stick with somebody with a spear, or you know, trip someone up in the street. Just, just anything, please. You got, you got some evil for me? somebody a mean name i might have to <laughs> i might just have to like <clears throat> I, might, I might have to go make a snide remark about how how uh how slow the hawking are at getting the jobs done shanky shanky uh <clears throat> oh he seems to have fallen on the ground and is bleeding profusely nothing to do with me I'm a good him. Honest. <laughs> Gotta watch out for Cap. Cap, I think we're having an effect on Cap. Cap's usually the nice one. And now he's coming up with ideas. We're slowly getting our nails into Cap. <laughs> I need to work on my evil laugh. <laughs> oh, it's Ava. 
Hope you lost a friendly wave. Lady Ava. Smiles. I don't think I got any of my writs done, did I? There's a rat. That's nights around here you need to be careful is. Oh. <clears throat> oh, for God's sake. Careful. Why so? Waves high. Greetings. I mean, it's not like I can't have my moments, but still. Underdarkers. Oh, he, his eyes, his eyes, he's come around here like his eyes go wide with shock. Oh my. Oh my. likes to enslave hins and elves huh. not whilst i'm around he puffs his chest he puffs puffs his chest out oh i'm heading to explore the forest have a ava warned me of the for for underdarkers a fae with a constant cold i will say though i do appreciate the encouragement to expand my options a bit I mean, I, I almost exclusively play evil, so <laughs> stick to what you know. Don't, don't, uh, you don't have to do what I say or what I do. Although I'm not doing much evil, am I? Really? Not at the moment. Soon, friends, soon. <laughs> But if no one's warned news people about them, then bad things happen. Ah, right, well. Good luck staying safe out there. Yeah, he's a Zam. Though, uh, I dare say you're neither neither him nor, nor elf. <laughs> he chuckles. I think I added this song to the playlist a long time ago. Hello, Kruver, I'm back. And I haven't heard this one in a long time. I mean, I understand, to be honest. I just don't feel wired to enjoy playing one. Time's from East to Rest. You two's be safe. Take care, Ava. Oh, fought earlier. Nods. Is she? Is she a? Is she an elf? Come on, snuggles out of the way! Jesus Christ! Jesus! I need to stop saying Jesus. Oh, the hand washer bowl is there. Look, <laughs> it's squint. Oh, it's Mario. Hell. Attracts vultures. <laughs> A vow of silence. 
What on earth? Oh, Sarah took a vow. <laughs> right, okay. Sarah smiles softly. <laughs> Chuckles. What do you... have you been a chan? Uh, oh, not bad. Smiles. Just got back from... from a wee adventure. Out in Goldorand. Lady, uh, lady... Hexagol. Hexagal. Hexagal. Ava the Druid. Ava the Druid and, uh, and my circle... circle's friend... Saphir. Saphir took the fight to uh, an undead... undead rising in the, uh, in the catacombs below the city. Yeah. Uh, states with a serious tone. I mostly <laughs> I mostly watched as they as they cleared the way. <laughs> he shrugs. What's the most ironic death penalty for a lumberjack? Water logging. Pretty ironic. Not a fan of that one. Take it out. Too happy that one. You quite separate out the first name mentioned, turning to Bella and the others. Oh. Some issues. Issues with this, uh, this, this woman. She seemed, she seemed friendly enough. He shrugs. She's forming a uh, mercenary band. Mercenary, mercenary band. Well, she grins softly. She wouldn't be the first good person we've accused of being a Bainite. <laughs> oh, a Bainite! He sounds. He sounds shocked. <laughs> there's some pretty ser there, but there's some ser pretty serious allegations. No one wants to focus on her healing process. Her not talking is part of it. Says, uh... Marie. I figured she hadn't summoned any fiends while you were with her. Nay, no fiend summoning. Nothing of the sort. He, uh, smacks... Smacks his mouth. Uh... She, uh, she seemed all, all too keen to smack the undead with her, with her weaponry. Might be accomplished, accomplished warrior, if you ask me. He nods. Oh, of course, the fear helped. He's, he's also, also quite impressive. I'd not got around. Uh, she mentioned uh, setting up, setting up, uh, setting up some property nearby. Oops. Death to tyrants, glory to hate, fight evil with evil. Interesting. He waves the XO. Hey, oh, Sheriff. Probably some of you, yes, but more Jan Hall. Oh, this is a good song. <clears throat> what 
Sarah say, many hide their true nature around strangers. I don't sigh. Such they do. You know, Sarah, I feel like that defeats the purpose of a vow of silence. <laughs> time to heal take vow for reflection when clan needs healing of self go on vision quest or spirit journey says oakheart charlie says not that i'm saying you ought to shut up even more she shrugs her shoulders no one said no writing it does help me so i mean it does not say she can't write just verbal silence sarah raises a brow questioningly to charlotte thanks for the help bella I guess I just didn't take a vow of silence so literally. Literally. Bella's a little cutie, ain't she? A little cutie. some things away uh beats being yelled at <laughs> yelled at for asking asking a simple question <laughs> he smirks before ducking his head what's the highest level you've gone to in P potm oh, i love like what's the first level that you get is it level two Do you get level two for free whatever the next level is over the starting level I've leveled up once from doing content. So. Um, I am very much a POTM noob. Uh, the old N plus one, yeah. Big O plus one. Big O of N, yeah. Plus one. I feel like one day when it's time to put Hunter on hiatus, I'll say something like, I will be taking a boat back to my farm. It's not goodbye, just see you later. <laughs> Are you dreaming about the future, Cap? Sarah looks to Bella and does a motion of putting her fingers on her lips and points down the hill. I want to do two onboardings at once. Did Bella say fluent? Prisoners of the Mist, the Ravenloft server. Cap. Seriously, you need Kiss Hill, methinks. <laughs> Kaz is funny. <sighs> Terry is around and shakes her head. Jewin, not to be confused with Jewin. Where is Jewin? I'm not seeing him. Oh, he went, he went sailing, didn't he? He always goes sailing, old pie. He loves sailing. I cannot stand sailing. 
Oh, it's Lady Hexagon. There she is, look. Ah, Lady Hexagon. Good to see you. He smiles. Well, I love Hunter. He's the special first level 30 stats. rather ravishing isn't she I do like the uh, the red I greet you rather ravishing in her dress hot you like it dear you down with that you into the uh, the uh, black hair yeah pale skin red in the black corset Dark fur on the back. She does look like a lady, doesn't she? Uh, I'm a lady. The dangers of truth seeking. Greetings, everyone. I'm Yvain Silvertide, devout of Savras, and I'm hosting a lecture on the many obstacles truth seekers must face. And overcome in their pursuit of knowledge, especially in matters related to the arcane. If you are interested, let us meet at the arcane towers foyer in two ten days, 25th of April. I missed that. No, that's next week. <laughs> the less sunshine they see, the more crew shine they'll see. Come here. Yo, pretty lady. Come here. You got a pretty mouth. <laughs> you got a pretty face. Gulderan Plague Memorial. Dear beloved citizens and citizens, citizens of Gulderan, in the wake of recent hardships, our hearts remain heavy. With the weight of the loss and grief, the toll of the plague has been profound, tearing families apart and leaving scars upon our community. Yet, amidst the darkness, a flicker of resilience burns within each of you. As we emerge from the shadows of despair, let us pause to honor the lives we have lost and the heroes who have emerged in our darkest hour. Together, we will gather at Beggar's Gate, a poignant symbol of our collective struggle to unveil a memorial that will stand as a testament more resilience and unity. In solemn remembrance, we will pay homage to those who have departed and offer prayers. Damn head thing won't sit. There we go. Prayers for those who remain. Moreover, we will celebrate the bravery and compassion of those who selflessly fought to bring an end to the plague, presenting them with the symbolic key to beggar's gate as a token of our gratitude gratitude following the ceremony let us come together in fellowship and warmth through shared stories poetry and music we shall commemorate the lives of our loved ones while embracing the joy they would wish for us oh she can talk just without words the city of gold around extends an invitation to all who wish to contribute or participate in this meaningful event. Please compete with myself, Laura, or with Maxine, who will be organising the event together. Further details will be provided in the days to come. With blessings and hope. I should totally go and do some... Uh, see if I can get in and get some artwork, some of my artwork made for that. Hmm. Terrible business, the plague. Do it, Laura wants lots of people there. Did some time as a peacekeeper in gold in gold during it. And you've uh, you've come out here in dire need unscathed, it would seem. Thankfully. 
a uh, courteous, courteous nod. Courteous nod. Hello there, hello. Moon elf. Reeks of warlock, don't she? Reeks of it. Hello there, hello. Come on. It was right there, says Kruva. Oh, Miss Jacqueline, hello there. Uh, oh. oh, how formal. <laughs> he chuckles. As soon as her vows end, she'll be she'll have learnt nothing and will be back to being a pain in my arse, says Charlotte. <laughs> aren't they a cute couple, eh? They're a cute couple, aren't they? I don't wager so next try and most likely I had a bit of a nasty fall yesterday night so I'm taking it easy why do you ask <laughs> it's funk no more funk funk's out of the list Terrible fall. I hope it wasn't. Uh... Uh, I just can't be harsh for being nice. Oh, how terrible! I'm trying to laugh in her face, you know, like ha! Ah! Weakling. I wanted to talk to you further about working with me and being requested by a few that I get someone who knows how to open locks. Oh, he. His eyes turn to, to a squint at low. Good with locks, good with locks, hmm? Oh, she's got the barbed lock. Quarter basher, yeah? Oh, well, I open locks, but my skill isn't that great. I've been meaning to enchant myself some apparel to aid with it a little more. Uh, but well, time and money. I still have any skill at all is better than anything. <laughs> he tusks. I we had to leave. Leave. Uh, we had to smash down. Smash down a few chests and the like on our last. Oh, that's the server. Yeah, interesting that uh, these people don't like uh, Lady Hexagon. She might be a Bainite, which makes sense because she was dressed in red and red and green, right? Oh, uh, actually, I already knew because Cass told us. In that secret meeting. I didn't think Baynights were them all that welcome in the Dale, if I'm honest. I thought you had to be... Colours don't mean anything. No, no, but that's the second person. I looked at the colours, the red and, the red and green, and went, she looks like a Baynite. And now two people have said she's a Baynite. One of which I trust knows what she's talking about.
I could um, make a disguise to praise Bane. I definitely need to make a Baneite, don't I? Like the cool thing, like if I had my whole bag of tricks and I wanted to like pin something on her, you know, like if I wanted to do something evil and get away with it, <laughs> I could cast doubt onto Lady Hexagol by using a black hand, you know, a, a Bay Knight disguise make a copy of myself, then get into another Bay Knight disguise, two different races, and then have a conversation with my illusion saying, Lady Hexagol's not happy with X, X person. Yeah, she said uh, she seemed awfully mad that, uh, you know, Tomlo, Tomlo Frumpy Tom, the, the farmhand, had said something terrible about Bane and the lady's not too happy with him and then as the circle we go and kill Tomlo Frumpy Tom and eat him and the Baneites get blamed that's the kind of thing that I would oh that'd be such fun but I can't do it yet Why are you guys so mean? <laughs> just a couple of... Just a couple of Bainites on the corner. Oh yeah, I'm, I've come to uh, join up with Lady Hexagol's uh, mercenary band. Apparently she's playing quite well. I reckon these lands are soft, right for the taking. Aye. Not they do. Could whisper it, you know what I mean? Whisper. Two whisperings. And just wait, because we know that there's spies in Bendyadale, like Impai is a spy. She spies on conversations. So if I knew she was around, I could. Dress up as two, two Bainites. go into the farm smash smash a few things up leave a sign that says you know glory to Bane or whatever <laughs> it'd be a fun little mystery I really stir the pot you know what I mean Soon, friends, soon. All right, what's on the, uh, the announcements? All goblin aid races can now use the goblin scourge flail. All weapons are not grandfathered and will need and will be up. Oh, updated automatically. Added a sit animation for the ogres. Oh, the ogres couldn't sit before. Bless them. Now they can rest. Two Bay Knights walk to a bar. Go on. I'm listening. They are very mean to the bartender. 
Makes sense. The bartender is very sad. Okay. This is not a joke. I'm not sad. I'm just disappointed. <laughs> I'm not mad. I'm not sad. I'm just disappointed. <laughs> Good one, says Perplexia. <laughs> you know what, for a clownfish, it's not all that funny. funny. Spoken like a true father, or at least mine, yeah. It was a dad joke. Dad joke of the century, that one. At least it was inventive. What it reads like, Kruver, is that you were taking it somewhere. Ran out of a punchline. The joke was not a joke, was the joke. I see what you did there. Nice try. Keep working on it. I, what I recommend is you hook up with Cap and put your minds together to come up with a super joke. You and Cap working together could be could be something of a of a force to be reckoned with. Oopsie. The bartender was the punchline. For the Bay Knights, yeah. Responding. I believe in you, game. Respond! Look how curly my hair's got, look. Look at this. Look at these curls. Look at the state of them. I want to have straight hair. You lot are so lucky with your straight hair. I don't even have, like, curly hair. I have, like, not that kind of kinky, but kinky hair where it like like uh, it's just all over the place like I don't get nice tight curls but I don't get straight hair either it's like somewhere in the middle it looks like a bainite walked into your hairline <laughs> my hairline? what are you trying to say? am I going bald? I've always had this hairline, so I know I'm not going bald, brother. But I do have a uh, a, a Vegeta hairline. Oh my god, this hat! There we go. I've got a big forehead as well. Look at this. If you wish, I can help you learn how to read. I had tutors that were quite brutal with teaching me, but I know... But I know how to have a softer touch. Oh, what language is... language is this? What's she teaching? I can speak fluent elf. He states with confidence. Perhaps in the next try, and I have plenty of books, but they. They. Uh, <laughs> you sure can, says Charlotte. <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> Beans with pride. Asher. <laughs> Asher's sticking up for my hairline because me and Asher have the same the same big forehead and uh, like hairline that goes like this. It like comes out and then goes back in like this. I've seen a picture of Asher. He's got the he looks very similar to me. She gives it out very well. Rest well, though. It was very nice to see you again. Interesting looking carry. I liked his look. Anybody that wears brown, love it. They cooked my boy in Dragon Ball Super. Did not like it. Uh, I knew I'll be around in the next uh, try and just my leg is a little, you know, funny. Ah, oh, Muriel, good to see you. Settling back in, are we? He waves. Oh, I see you've you've met uh, Lady Hexagon. Epic reputation. Is that if I've got epic reputation? What did Muriel say? Mm-hmm. Evening. <clears throat> oh, what language, uh, what language, language do you teach, uh, lady? I, I half, half heard, uh, you, uh, discussing, discussing lessons with Lowe. Esther's infecting you with her speech, eh? They were saying cool and fuh in a week. Fuh, I already do that, says Charlotte. Oh, she does not know how to read and write. Oh. Not even common. He sounds puzzled. It's uh, not something I'm proud of. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, not everyone has the benefit, benefit of a decent, decent education growing up, he admits. Some people don't get taught and I at the moment only know common. I knew the trade tongue, however, I'd gotten rusty, rusty lately. I knew the trade tongue. Common is the trade tongue. I'd always thought common. Common was the trade tongue. Yes, the benefits of having teachers beating lessons into you really puts nobles a step ahead. <laughs> oh, I wish. Oh, how I'd. Uh, common is the common tongue. That would be under common, Nishan. Oh, it's an Aralethism. Right, okay. Gotcha. Oh, I see. No troubling. No troubling. How did you. How did you come to know. I don't know, uh, that's such a, such a dark language, the language, the language of slavers. Why 
my wife was a slave from the end of the dark, it was her native tongue. Ex-wife. The eyes, the woman's, the woman's uh, hand. Enjoyed using it still, and yes. Ah. What's her name? Lady, Lady Hexagon. What is your name? What's your flavor? Tell me what's your flavor? Ooh. She had give, had me give up my last name. Which means what? She's not. Her name is Ki Kitaira, however. His mouth, uh, he, he, uh, he mouths the, uh, the words, the word, the name. Ah, oh, yeah, that, that's a, that's a mouthful. <laughs> Chuckles. Kitty. <laughs> Curious last names. Oh, you've been a grammar Nazi, Muriel. Come on now, you know what she meant. A fine, he nods. A fine name. Thrull, Thruller, 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 or Thruller. Not a bad one. Whatever then. Better than whatever, I guess. And why, why have you uh, separated? You don't mind my prying. Dot, dot, dot. She got with child. <laughs> His eyes go wide as uh, as he rolls them, rolls them off to the ground. <laughs> A shake of his head and a quiet whistle. Oh my. <laughs> I'm not a biology doctor. Biology, really? You cheated on me with my best friend, she explained. <laughs> uh, and the heaven, then the hells, the hells. The hell's take him. <laughs> take him, eh? <laughs> Chuckles. Yeah, that's where I was getting at nods at Jacqueline. All these two whispering about. Did she waved me? She she shaved. Since she saved me from the hells, I would not wish that on her. I don't wish anything on her, really. Put my slippers on. Oh, you're not bitter about it. You know, it's quite commendable, really. Surely you want revenge. I mean, she's she's got what she wants. Why? Why wouldn't you be happy? F be happy for her. <laughs> <laughs> Stir the pot just a little bit. Well, 
Like, oh, aren't you supposed to be a Bainite? Where's that... Where's that, uh, you know, trade? Well, she couldn't help but huff at that. I have much bigger things to worry about right now. <laughs> yeah. I've got something you she huffs at that. Yeah, she couldn't help but huff at that. Nerd. Cries. Cries in evil. I love when they steal 50 gold. I think so. That was a waste of 50 gold. What did I miss? Feelings make you weak. Disgusting. <laughs> oh, dear. She makes me laugh. She really does. <laughs> Feelings make you weak. Disgusting. Farewell, Rainy. Tell your husband I said hi. So she's got an ex-missus who she definitely wants to murder. Um... What other sadness is there around that we could get into? Sarah's obviously sad about something, but she's not going to let us in because she's too spiny. <laughs> she's far too spiny to let anybody in, so... Uh, I guess we can't sponsor some uh, some vengeance for her. Not just yet, anyway. Maybe in time, as things start to calm down. Uh. Your, your mercenary 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 work to to see to yeah he nods that'll keep you keep you quite busy I would imagine have you had many many sign ups already Official, she nods towards Muriel. She's still considering. Oh, he turns, turns to uh, to Muriel with a warm smile. Ah, circles embrace Muriel. How was your will save? Asking for a friend. <laughs> Shield. Shan cast Shadow Shield for no reason at all. What is this? Transcend. Mm, well, that's enough of that. Thank you very much. Which circle? Oh, uh, uh, oh, circle, uh, circle of friends, circle of friends, Muriel, he nods, uh, I, uh, I represent, represent, uh, the circle, circle faction, uh, you'll see, you'll see our members, members, uh, about the place, we tend to dress in blue.
Uh, shall we finish the writ you in? Ah, okay. I tackle the place alone all the time. Was just getting some coins, says you in. Make money, that's why people engage in trade, Charlotte. Oh, says Jacqueline. I'd rather have the gems than the gold, says Charlotte. Ah, chuckles. He chuckles and uh, remarks Charlotte's way. Oh, to be lucky enough not to need need the gold. Nah. Mm. Right, I reckon I can go tackle that then. Gold's more useful. I would rather have the coin. Coin can be used to grease grease many a wheel, many a wheel. I would imagine. This works. Heh, gold's never done me any good. Farewell, then. <laughs> good chuckles. A moment, Lady Exegol. I've, uh, I've, uh, I've been, I've been meaning, meaning to catch up, catch up with Cass for some while. Three, two, one, go. How's it, old lady? Smiles. She carries a neutral expression, eyes distant. Fine. Fine, you say? How very unlike you. <laughs> Normally brimming, brimming with joy. What's gotten into you? Hey, Tug, how's it going? Dot, 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 dot. Did you need something, Asham? Just a wee chat and a catch up. Catch up if you time. for tea and crumpets. Alright. Hey, Fuzzy's there, look. What's up, bro? Fast. <laughs> You've uh, learnt a, a few new tricks. Yeah, yeah, eyes the the red glow, the red glow. She clenches and unclenches fists as she strolls. Oh, <laughs> something's got all wound up. More than a few, Ishan. She keeps calling him Ishan. Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, is it the wedding thing? I wonder. <laughs>
<laughs> Could be something to do with L. I spoke with L the other day. <laughs> he chuckles. <laughs> See what gets said. I've not seen her in a trine. Oh, it's not that then. Careful. I <laughs> hear PC. PC gambler. Uh, I mean, Cass and Ishan go way back, so I can I can afford to poke the bear a little bit. But she is scary. Don't get me wrong. His head. <laughs> she seems to be in a mood. She poked him. <laughs> I guess she's learnt something. I also spoke with uh, with Mina too. Stop short of the door. Uh, Wharf Town? You're nuts. Flare had narrowed at this wharf town comment. I see. I'm not sure how this works. If somebody was already scrying me, have they just been banished now? Now that that's down, or do they get to hang around? <clears throat> right. You can't put it down and start chatting basically like you it's possible for them to catch catch something oh uh, uh me me and uh was it zafir or was it theron me and a oh it was juin was it juin me and Juin headed out, headed out, headed out to take down the, uh, the Wolf Town Boys. Town Boys. We saw, uh, Mina on the way. He stares at the wall behind his shan eyes, slightly sunken, distant, and tired expression. Is everything alright, old lady? You look worked to death. And you honestly dis only discuss War of Tanishan. Is that all? Nothing else. Nothing else. He assures. I have nothing else to discuss. He smiles.
Expression softens, calming, her hands relax. Fists unclenching. What did you wish to discuss, old man? We need put on put on a party. Uh, get the, uh, the circles affairs back on track. You know it's. We need also to post post on the board at Bendir. Uh, spread our spread our message our message of friendship and support about the town. Hey, Dar, how's it going? Time, location, and who are we inviting? I will need to know much... How and how much must food drink to prepare? No, starts to bleed slightly. A trickle of blood from her right nostril. <clears throat> Shall we say in a tri weeks? In two trines? No, not two trines. In a tri tri. Oh no, because it. Uh, I was going to say. In a try weeks weeks time, but the festival the festival is on. Yeah, the festival's on next weekend. Yeah, try week is next weekend. But the festival's on then, isn't it? Perhaps we should offer offer to perhaps we should speak with Tomlo and offer to sponsor. Sponsor, uh, sponsor the festival in some way. Perhaps provide, perhaps bring, bring the circle together and provide goods and services for the event. I was going to suggest the same as Shan. Ah, she closes her eyes, opening them after a few seconds, both looking bloodshot. I'm feeling Ishan, feeling things I thought I killed when I, when I killed her. These the, the things are supposed to be dead. She shudders slightly. It's like somebody might be watching, Cass. Ah, is it is it so bad to feel, old lady? A look of disappointment washes over his face. He nods up into the ceiling. Love is a lie. Cooked up by those, those celestial, celestial, uh, 
uh, celestial uh, it was trumped up celestials uh, that would would lie that would would uh, uh, speak of sweet sweet nothings to these people he licks his lips there is no love there is no hope Eternity. I need your help with something, old man. Something for Aludi's training. Speak of it. Is it time? Another reset. Oh, that's good. He peers out the window. Storm's brewing. An innocent one for her to prove her devotion to me with. Such a leap. <clears throat> you test a test of defense. Perhaps first. One of one of twisted twisted loyalties. Let her question question her own actions before before taking a true leap. She'll be ready or she will be food. Ooh. <laughs> so be it. He states flatly. Love is the lie by which by which she shall shall be twisted. He he agrees. <laughs> I don't know what that means. You've been speaking with Theron. Hmm? <laughs> I know this tongue. I've I've heard this tongue before. No, I know not. Her nose stops bleeding, her expression turning to the kind warm Cassie we all know. It is truly good to see you, Ishan. Was there something else you wished to discuss? She smiles warmly. Be sure to check with Tom Lowe. Hang on. Uh, this woman, this lady, this lady Hexagol. She stands accused, accused of fiend. Or, uh, not accused. Uh, there was mention, mention of fiend summoning when her name came up. She's also started a mercenary, mercenary, mercenary company, mercenary company. Uh, two signed up and another considering, considering joining. Perhaps we could encourage one of our members to infiltrate and join her her band. 
townsfolk are already mistrustful of her. She would make an excellent patsy should we wish a... <laughs> he smiles before licking his lips. She will make a fine sacrifice upon the altar of she scoffs justice. Should too many eyes uh, come looking. The townsfolk are already mistrustful of her. She would make an excellent patsy should we wish a... He smiles before licking his lips. Soon we'll hold, hold the key, key to uh, framing, framing her demise and our, and sating our desires. Whoosh. And another storm blows in. No, reset why? The drama, ah! <laughs> I almost lost all the food, saved it at the last second. Oh, did you have some food on a stall, Ansel? They did another one, yeah. It's sometimes when they do a reset and a patch, there's some problem, isn't there? Oh, at the bar, okay. Oh, I meant those, um, those temporary cart things that you can load up. <clears throat> yeah, I, I don't know if they're fixtures or what. I think you can put things in them though, right? Yeah, like you can put things in barrels and stuff, right? That was fun. It's, uh, I do feel like we need more more things to plot. Like, uh, I need to find... Uh... Oh, Ewan has sticky fingers. That's another thing we can talk about. Uh, I caught him rummaging around in our, in our uh, room. I think he might have a penchant for stealing things. That might be uh, encouraged. You're working on the L plot, that's cool. Obviously I can lend a hand to that. What else do we need to speak about? There's nothing going on with the Hawking just yet. They were like, oh, it'll be a few days. It's been five days now. I think we applied on Monday. But it's, it's taking its sweet time. <sighs> it's tough. Inish efficiency. Well, when I'm in charge and everybody languishes in... <laughs> we'll review this after tea and biscuits. <laughs> Moon's, like, just got a way of sticking in the, the hidden... The hidden jibes. She it really has. <laughs> Ain't you, Moon? <laughs> I don't know better. I'd say you hate Hins. What do you get against Hins, Moon? <sighs> they are short. Yeah. Stack one on the other, though. You get almost a human. Almost. Not quite a human. But almost a human. They are short and cute. They are a bit cute, aren't they? They are, well, no, no, not all of us are cute. Come on now, Cam's not cute. Who else isn't cute? Like Ewan, he's not, he's not a cute hen. Booker's not a cute hen. 
They are the embodiment of all that is wrong in the world. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They're a bit good, aren't they? Short people? Hey, thankful. How's it going? Yeah, short humans are even worse. Right, guys? Right? <sighs> There's a huge, cute little hen around named Jupiter, Juniper Juneshine. So precious. And confirm. Normally I'd agree, but my wife is short, says Asher. Fuzzy's back. Quickly, quickly, quickly get that ward up. There's a cute little hen around named Juniper. Can confirm. There's a cute little hen around named Juniper, so precious. Can confirm, says Perplexia. Normally I'd agree, but my wife is short, says Asher. Can't stand the five elevens of the world, says it's thankful. There's a there's a hen in town named Ewan. Where's a where's a where's a hood often? Wooden leathers. Uh, he was spotted uh, raiding raiding our our room when the lease when the lease ran ran free. Admitted to having sticky fingers. He chuckles. Thankfully, he uh, thankfully he returned returned uh, the stolen goods. Surprising for a hen. <laughs> I caught him. I caught him in the in the act. Though the lease the lease had had run its course. Shrugs. <laughs> I'd have done the same. <laughs> he laughs. I may have a connection with the noble house that runs the castle outside of Cordor. The keep. Uh, what's the name? What's the name of the keep? Typical Hinnish behaviour fits right in, yeah. Nicking things, little, little rascal, little rascal. Only three things come from Scalyard. Uh, trouble, adventurers, uh, what was it? Adventurers, merchants, and rascals, I think is what Maya said. We need to meet with Theron Dewin and make plans for where to focus our efforts in Darrow Deep, I believe. Uh, what's the name, the name of this? This, uh, this noble. <clears throat> our efforts, our efforts should, uh, how do you know a hen's been stealing? Lady Mist. I feel like I've heard that name before. I don't know if it's meta though. Oh no, I think she, she mentioned it the other day, didn't she? In that other meeting, I think. <laughs> They've still got their hands. How do you know a hen's been stealing? They've still got their hands. Oh. They've got hands, they'll steal with them. Right, okay. They are... Lady Miss, they are looking for a... She grins. Cook. Perfect. Perfect. You'd, uh... You'd fit right in. He, uh, he admits. I need to find... Find an application... For these, uh, for these, these fine and dexterous, dexterous hands, dexterous hands, some, some means by which to further, further our circle's cause.
<clears throat> we should also uh, oh Zafir Zafir has joined joined our ranks as well he pulls pulls a set of uh, pay, uh, a set of listed papers from his plaid he points out a signature outer circle material for now though he did hand uh, though another another hand uh, another reach into a fold and three gems or oh, three wisp wisp covered gems appear he did provide these Now, I know not if he's working for the enemy and seeks to test to test me or if these were if these were given given freely as a friend might. Should he ask, I would state they were they were disposed of by uh by the light light of life and a and a paladin's paladin's hammer mina could make use of those and mina ishan come what may she is not to be touched ever by anyone she is mine as for Safir, keep him outside he speaks with albert crow is he at best a fool, at worst a spy? Oh. <laughs> if he speaks, if he speaks with Albert, uh, this is most troubling. Uh, you've done well to bring, bring this information. <clears throat> I'll be keeping, keeping one of these. these on to Mina. Circle, circle, circle favour here. The eyes cast carefully. You're not growing attached, are you? A, 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 uh, 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 more than a hint of distaste. Distaste washes over his tone. <sighs> the stone, the stone held high. He crushes it, crushes it, crushes it uh, with his with his hand. Uh, deathly, deathly, deathly mists around his fist before dissipating dissipate dissipating within his torso mists around and twist down his arm before dissipating within his torso torso center Ownership of the woman, control does not mean attachment, old man. You of all of us should know the difference. <clears throat> he sounds unconvinced. Of course. What up, dude? How's it going? Hey, it's a germ. Her tone and wavering voice betrays her true feelings. He sounds unconvinced, of course I do. And I know you too. You do too. He raises an eyebrow. An eyebrow at her. Before, before moving on.
Mm-hmm. How's it going, it's uh, you're alright, buddy. I tried a couple of characters and I think I found one to sit. Uh, just a few more, just a few more, a few more months. I know it. So the secrets, secrets of warding, warding and scrying will be my own. Then I can prepare, prepare the way for the hunt. Have you seen or heard heard from Theron? Did you see him? Ask of him to search out search out the, the place. The place of the hunt. I would have have his keen eyes survey. Survey and find lands suitable, suitable for a cha for a luring and chase on a night of our choosing. Their eyes drive over to the cushions behind Isham. A small hint of a smile. I saw him two tries ago. He's likely tired. I will speak with the Corridor Noble. I also have contacts with an noble elf in my own. But at some point soon I will need to decide which and where f to focus my our efforts. Whom do you think would best suit our plans? <clears throat> the eyes. Cass. Who's from who from whom do the eyes do the eyes come? That is the the front on which we fight. Our efforts should 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 be should be should be spread between two objectives. One the hunt. Two countering countering that that whelp. Albert and his compatriots. I still don't know who sends the eyes. We need to find out. Perhaps we should find some way to flush the flush uh, our spies out. Perhaps you could reveal, reveal a fakery. My agents will continue to dig, we will know soon enough. Should we plan a party using dark, dark terms? We can sit out and wait for our accusers to arrive, revealing themselves to us. We welcome them to our party and know them for who who they are. She clicks her tongue. Then running it along her teeth. Thinking. Not yet, but we may in the future. For now, I will continue to dig. Very well. What news does Mina bring Bring of the Winter Guard? I saw Albert. Albert at uh, the Hawk. Or the Eagle. Eagle Inn. 
at Goldarand earlier this try. Well, we did not converse. He seemed keen, keen to watch, watch our activities. Sorry, it's uh, um, sucked into the roleplay there. Yeah, I tried a couple of characters and I think I found one to sit on for a while. As Cap says, what are you thinking about going for? My apologies for not getting back to you on that one, buddy. I know they are a weak and dying faction looking to grasp onto some kind of meaning, hoping we could be that meaning. Mina has convinced them to doubt Maga's claims. And now their eyes slowly shift to her, but we cannot be too hasty. And time shall heal, heal this, this vicious, vicious wound Maga has uh, inflicted upon us. But one mention of our hunts and those eyes will be back. Make no, make no mistake. Time and parties, old man, she smiles, a devilish smile. Whereabouts is this Winterguard based? Goldorand? Honestly, it's a little hard to split your focus as the streamer. I can personally understand that. Oh yeah, but I usually do pretty good at doing both. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm crap at both. <laughs> I just think I'm good. Yeah, I'm working on a trap rogue. The stealth and pickpocket of monsters is fun. I played a thief in Ultra Online. That's right. Actually, playing a rogue is fun in RLF. If you want to make money. Just west of the city, a large manor along the road, open to the public of all things. Full of books and paintings of old victories, but often empty. <laughs> Bad stream, a great ego though. Ah, <laughs> uh, Kruver really lightens my day, he really does. <laughs> Stick that fucking needle in, you little shit. They have a mysterious benefactor, Rich, who keeps them afloat. I am trying to discover who. Any names of their, their agents? We know of Albert. Albert and... Um, this uh, Barley... Barley fellow. I'll be honest, I tried a stealth rogue once. By the time I was stealth into the point of near invisibility, I actually felt empty. Yeah, that's if you play a stealth rogue. Those are the only two active members I know. As I said, they are a dying faction, but they have connections with the guard and gold around. It does not sound likely that they're responsible for our eyes, then. I was followed by one of the guards on my last visit. He just watched, but it was quite obvious. Perhaps it's the Goldorand? Goldorand guard that's watching us? Can Mina... Can Mina... Gain, gain access to the gold, Goldorand guard? Off the back... Off the back of... Um, her trust within the Winter Guard. Perhaps uh, you could chase. I will ask her. She does as I tell her without question. Oh. Good. He nods. What else is there? If she could find out, find out the depths of the uh, uh, we yeah we need to find we need to find out who's watching us. 
We need to find out who's watching us. Who's watching us? Spread Mina out to to Gildarand. The eyes, Cass, and perhaps you. Perhaps you could chase chase up any any rumor of our doings doings in Cordor. I have a feeling that Myon has little interest in our affairs. Kaldor, Kaldor could be trusted to push push Circle PR there, though he won't spy. I want to say it's bad, maybe I was doing it poorly, but I like how some people feel having summons is boring by proxy potentially doing nothing. Being stealthed and walking around the, all the time felt lonely and unengaging. Yeah, I, I agree, like it's not fun gameplay. Because like you say, you're invisible and uh, you're just clicking on monsters, you're walking and clicking on monsters. Theron could also be asked to infiltrate Myon. He adds, I will work, work with the Hawkin. Perhaps Dewin could be asked to make his way to Brogenden. Brogendenstein. Hey, take it easy, Asher. Thanks so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. I'll be sure to catch the VOD later. Cheers, buddy. I really appreciate you stopping by, man. Have a good one. You know, it's a meeting soon between us all. Theron, Dewey, and you and myself. We need to coordinate. We are even now too scattered. Oh. When she's... brought into our dark embrace. She could also be positioned somewhere. Any news of Kale? I don't much stealth unless I'm just trying to relax and make some easy money. I like to roleplay and walk around with people, so I made sure to be able to lockpick and do trap work. Yeah, that's a, a rogue is a very social class, for sure, because you're a utility. Uh, you need a tank. I believe him dead. I have not seen him in weeks. Who else was there? A voice is without emotion or care. Godwin. She smiles warmly. Wherever he is. Extend extend our circles gratitude. Extend our circles embrace to him. Let us see if he can he seeks to get me a council with the owner of the Black Citadel in the Abyss. And he continues his dark work. He nods, nods with glee. He nods, he nods, his expression devoid, devoid of, uh, devoid of joy. There are far too many lock opening mechanics outside of Rogue and RLF, same with search and disable trap. Yes, but rogues get traps and cool uh, flanking is much like Mina mine <laughs> uh, you always you always are off or oh, ever lost lost to me lost to me old woman old lady <laughs> He, he, uh, a wide and fanged grin spreads across his face.
but your network your network is proving proving a uh, an ample uh, uh, an asset to our work to our to our efforts you know, it's mag's mag's wound is will soon be uh, soon be but a soon be but a scratch and then a and then a troublesome troublesome and then an ugly an ugly scar before before long lost to the annals annals of history I shall outlast her. I'm mostly taking rogue levels with flint for tumble and spotless and check bonuses. I will say though, one particular direction I want to take advantage of with it is saying, I have the knowledge and strength to shatter your bones. Oh, flint Farouk. She is but a mouse scampering among a pack of ravenous beasts. She means nothing. I have work to do. I have work to see too. No bit. You have your orders. He reaches into his, uh, uh reaches to his, uh, waist and pulls out a set of keys and spins them over his, sh over his finger. Hell has already seen, seen to it to, to arm me with, uh, Tomlo, sorry. Tomlo has already seen, seen fit to arm me with a key. He chuckles in the usual hidden way. It's that one rogue skill where sneak attacks lower your strength. Circles embrace, Ishan. Circles embrace, Cass. Smiles wide. Hi. A meeting soon, you nods. Good scene, I like that. I, I feel like we got some direction there. Some, like, we need to find out where these eyes are coming from. If it's not the Winter Guard, then who is it, right? So we should, uh, yes, direction. Uh, we should we should look try and find out who's who's spying on us basically where are these eyes coming from the more people we can potentially rule out the better basically I mean, it could just be like evildoers for all I know. It could be Maganeer uh, and someone else. Like Citadel, great. Now the demons are back. Devils, thankful devils. <laughs> Well, I guess we did do demons, didn't we? we? Tried to summon the devils. Somebody was a dirty traitor. Oh, sorry. Yes, uh, the demons are back. I thought you were getting at um, the gone stuff. It all comes back to the red star. I knew it. <laughs> sorry for the last trial. Yeah, but I've got great news. Hell, townsfolk. Oops. 
Hello. <laughs> comes back to the red star oh, it was such such fun when the sky lit up red wasn't it that was good oh tomlo's there look hey oh tomlo so you all need something you and How are you, Shan? Dwarf to just looking to work on your farm as you uh, think he went into the knocking hawk. Hawk's nest. Is that this place? Ah, yeah. Ulrich. He's a good lad, him. I've, I've uh, worked with him on the road. Gotcha, I gotta get a speedy scent, but I'll speak with him right after. He was like a hard worker, devoted to his job. I'm gonna uh, follow Tom Lowe. Talk about festival business. What if I fall in? Tomlo? I have uh, I have business to discuss regarding the festival. When you've time, of course. By all means, I'm just sending the speedy then. I'll be right back out. But then I'll wait here for him. Or will I? Bend end. <laughs> it might be worth just abandoning the circle. Just being like, get rid of it. And everybody just go into their own little corner, you know what I mean? Cass goes to Cordor, Dewing go goes to Brogendenstein, Theron goes to Mayon, I stay in the Dale, and we just break up the circle and be like, yeah, we, we decided, uh, you know, it wasn't worth pursuing. There's already all this other, you know, all this other stuff going on, um, and we can, because then we don't have that like attachment to the faction, uh, the public-facing faction, because the public-facing part of the faction is is under question now, you know, the when nice people stuff uh, is being questioned. <laughs> so it's worth like just. Just been in that and being like, you know, finding out who's watching who and pretending that you're on uh, the side of the people who are investigating and watching and stuff like that. And just getting lost in that. Well, not necessarily lost, but uh, deep into that stuff. Just food for thought. Thanks for waiting, Ishan. Just reaching out to Mokla about the event too. Mokla? I haven't heard of uh, this uh, this fellow, uh, Mokla. Lady, actually, Dwarven, lass. Oh! I do know who it is now. Real nice one. I had a, a, a little a little thing with her on Knive. There was definitely something going on. It was like bumping of uh that all like fella come out. Dwarf and nice the same sentence, yeah, that's rare. He chuckles. 
Having met uh, Master Master Ashbourne, Ashbourne, I would agree. Chuckles. Working a small group works best for misdirection. Perhaps. I don't see uh, Ulrich. Ulrich out here. Kind of crashed out in the inn, not sure really. <laughs> oh, there's some plenty of nice dwarves, he says with a wave of the hand, and that's fine then. I'm sure he'll come out here anywho eventually, yeah? In the meantime, we can talk about our thing. Of course, that's the. Uh, um, uh, uh, farm master. Uh, you, as, as you, you, you may not, uh, you may not be aware, uh, but I actually, uh, 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 re represent. Oh, there she is. Oh, Mockler, there she is. Look, chop for now. Look at the. Look at the fun bags on her. <laughs> Greetings. He, uh, <laughs> he, uh, he states with a warm with a warm smile how oh, can I help you my friend rim glimmer speak spark even I've seen him before is he in he from he's, he's a tall gnome isn't he holy crap Look at the size of that fella! Well, come on inside, uh, Mokla, we'll have a chat to uh, you too, Ishan. Ooh. Oh, there's Ulrich, look. Ah, there he is. friend meet uh, meet uh, farm farm master Tomlow <laughs> they're trying to explain something to Ulrich well I'm Tom Lowe you were looking to work on the farm if you'll be around for a bit I'd be happy to chat with you about that Nods. Uh, and yeah, the, this here is Mockler, one of the former head managers of Shire Farm. Oh, he looks impressed. Oh, very uh, impressive. Do I say impressive? Get the size of it. Oh, oh, bread! <laughs> he reaches over and grabs, grabs the, uh, grabs the half loaf. A knife in hand, he cuts himself, cuts himself. A doorstop, doorstop-sized, sized, sized uh, slice 
and coats coats it in uh air stale air stale in slightly air stale butter the uh, the creamy the creamy lumps mashed into the folds into the fluffy fluffy folds of the bread Anywho, Muckler, long and short, I saw you have an event going on the night of the Harvest Festival. No problem there. I was wondering if you might be interested in merging efforts on this. He stuffs, stuffs the bread slice in his mouth. Between, between smacking of lips. Aye. And, uh, our circle. Circle was wanting to put... Oh, aye. <laughs> His eyes, his eyes crossing pleasure. My oh my, that butter. <laughs> Smacks his lips again. Ah, uh, uh, to put, put on, put on a party of our own. Anywho, Muckler, blah, 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 blah. We've already read that. I, I was asked by Dory to do it expressly at her inn, Bitter Smile. I think, I think she needs to promote the inn a bit. He stuffs the bread slice into his mouth between smacking of his lips. Ah, yeah, now. Nah. Circle was wanted to put his eyes crossing pleasure. Why am I that butter? He smacks his lips. To put on a party of our own. Ooh. Ooh, that butter. Obviously, if you need help for the festival, I can help you however I can. And always good to meet another farmer, Ulrich, he says to Ulrich with a broad smile. I'm from down in Amethulua, on a, the main, one of the main trade cities down in Lurin. He looks back to Mokla. Oh, it's Tom Lowe's good. Tom Lowe knows what he's doing. And I see I can get entirely... I, I, see, I can see I get entirely why that would be the case then. Hmm. If you want, I can sing, says Muckler. Tomla says, only fair option would be to ensure folks know the festival ends a four-year shindig and shuffle them over there. Ah, if there's... there's... a smack of his lips. Any... any energy left... for another... for another party... party afterwards. <laughs> he takes another bite... Uh, of the, uh, the... the... blathered... That's a northern northernism. Blathered, blathered in butter, slice, slice of bread. Oh, don't worry. For insult competitions, people somehow find the event. Blatherden. Ah, uh, he scoops up. Fair enough. I suppose that's true there, Shan. Hmm. Looks tend to get tired. Get tired by uh, by festivities. Uh, a large. He, he says around a mouthful mouthful of bread before a big gulp. Oh, I. Uh, nods towards Tomlo with a smile and looks the Mockler visibly a little impressed by the dwarf. <laughs> oh dear, of course. What's he looking at? <laughs> a wry grin. Grin at uh, Ulrich's, Ulrich's gaze. Tasty dwarf. Oh, it's the server crashed. Server's crashed. Oh no! <laughs> Ansel's food!
<laughs> reading a little, a little private message somebody sent me. My eyes only. <laughs> uh, you'd think that the double reset would have helped. Yeah, you would have thought so, wouldn't you? But you know what it's like. You know what the old, the old gals like. <laughs> I'm talking about eels, boy. Eels up inside the server. Finding an entrance where they can. Um, I best let the dogs out and go and make a drink and maybe find another snacky snack, eh? Two snacky snacks in one night. Ah, we're living the dream. Um, so, calm down, chill out, put your feet up, relax, enjoy the music, and I'll see you all in five minutes.
Sit down, little doggy. That's it. Good girl. Hello, everyone. I got a treato for the doggos. I don't know what's uh, I don't know what's wrong with me, man. I'm just like constantly hungry, and it's doing my head in because I'm trying to lose weight. So I've got another apple. This is probably like the third or fourth apple I've had today. I'm nearly eating a whole pack of apples today, I'm trying to stave off the hunger pangs. Alright, there we go. Ooh. Ah. Back from the uh, from the lavy, it's Miles. It's because you're eating cow food. <laughs> Grass is good for cows, cows are good for us, everyone's happy. Oh! Interesting. Interesting take, Moon. I would have had you down as one of them... One of them uh, grass eaters, if I'm honest. Knowing what I know about Moon, I honestly would have put them down as one of those... Uh, good for nothing. <laughs> They're not good for nothing. They're actually probably very... Uh, I'm just joking when I say this. I actually think veganism is a very uh, noble thing to do if you can manage it. One of those good for nothing vegans. <laughs> Dogs looking at me like I'm eating some some sort of beautiful delicious like steak or something and I was like it's just an apple core do you want it she went nah I'm alright what else she got I haven't got nothing it's all gone go lie down I mean, the arguments... For, <laughs> I really don't want to make this a, a political thing. I eat meat. I eat loads of meat. I eat three kilograms of chicken every week. I drink milk. I drink loads of milk. I eat eggs. Right? No problems for me. But I, as a meat eater, know that what I'm doing isn't good for the animals. It's not good for the environment. Yeah, it's not the more mo it's not the most moral choice. I know that veganism isn't a perfect moral choice either, but one is more ethical than the other, without a doubt, no doubt about it. Uh, right. Anyway, let me get into this conversation. But people are free to enjoy I, I, you know, I know it's not ethical to eat, uh, uh, or it's not as ethical as not eating an animal. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, something has to die. Something has to die. Absolutely. But there's also uh, the land that's required to feed animals, right? That's the other big thing. And factory farming is... Not very nice. Uh, even fact, even free range is not great. I mean, you know, uh, let's, let's change the subject anyway, because nothing brings people together like divisive politics. You know what I mean? Uh, but that's my take. Uh, is uh, I know it's bad, but I partake in it anyway. <laughs> yeah. Nothing brings people together like divisive politics, everyone. Um. <laughs> uh, he seems to uh, seems to awaken from from uh, from a daydream. Ah, 
I certainly hope I do. I'm looking to hand out the organizers of some events to my employees. And yeah, the farm's full on rented, rented out now. Aye, aye. Well, if you you need need of any any assistance, uh, Sir Tom, uh, Ma, Master Tom Low, uh, I'd be happy happy to lend it. Cass is a uh, Cassandra. Cassandra, my my most trusted trusted uh, companion and second second uh, ad uh, administrator of the circle is a capable cook. Uh, I'm hoping that, uh, that maybe something we could discuss, Ishan. Darren, uh, uh, I can help uh, help with gathering gathering materials uh, and providing. Oh, is that Cassie that's living on the farm, or a different one? The one on the one on your farm, I. Right? He pats his belly. She's, she's kept me kept me well fed enough. <laughs> he chuckles before before uh, before his hand reaches out and grabs grabs the loaf again. Does your friend Cassie also brew wine? Yeah, she's been real excited about this. Uh, she may be capable of, though uh, she hasn't expressed uh, any wish to. Though that could change. He smiles. Fucking ain't smiling. God. To glare, leer, glare, bark. Oh, what good are you for? Man, what bloody good are you except for complaining like a milk drinker? You know? Oh, to go back to those days, eh? Speaking of thriving, poor Oleg's been on the hook for now for a while. Hook. I could offer her some good coin if she can provide me with good quality wines. Aye, well, uh, uh, if you provide provide a list of what you want, uh, I'll see to it. Uh, she can. Uh, she's uh, uh, informed, at the very least. He nods to Ulrich. What sort of uh, wines are you in the business for? Are you uh, looking for? Looking for? Drinking sorts or just? Hey, don't worry, sit on I kept myself busy. I'm doing all kinds of things. Is he after like buff wines, or is he after drinking wines? Are these wines wines uh, wines for for enjoyment or uh, wolfing down down for transmutative uh, properties? He he adds. What kind of work do you do then? You said you're a farmer. I'd figured you'd be able to brew your own wine unless you need to up production. Looking for good red, white, sparkling, and dry wines. Ah, we're drinking then. He nods. I'm sure there's uh, some sort of uh, farmhouse. I don't see why uh, Cass, Cass, and uh, and all on the farm aren't put put there. I'm a server at the Hopeful Lotus Restaurant in Cordor. Ah, there we go. I don't see why Cass and all on the farm can't put their heads together and produce some farmhouse, farmhouse, uh, farmhouse wines together. You're out back throwing laundry over. What does that even mean? Roger, roger. Roger, roger. Dogs are going mad. I heard the music and my smooth brain thought that that was something being played beyond my screen, says Cap.
just imagine underwear being tossed over the fence to the neighbor's yard or something. It's a very, it feels like an Americanism, that one, doesn't it? Throwing laundry over. Over the line, right? But I'd want to become a cook and brewer myself. For that, I'd need ingredients, and working the fields would give me strength in those ingredients. Aye, aye, that's a, that's a fine plan. Plan, friend. Makes sense uh, that you want to, uh, want to get get access to the farm. Not. <laughs> oh, I hope those those buggers in Cordor appreciate appreciate what you do for them. Reaches, reaches uh, for the bottle. Aye, they do. I got good coin. Well, there's coin. Well, there's coin, and then there's the enjoyment of the craft. Yeah, it's to wash, to wash a fine wine, a fine wine. Wine about one's palate to uh, savor, savor the rich, the rich flavors and and uh, uh, and fine, uh, fine to uh, to wash a fine wine about one's palate to savor the rich flavors uh, and inhale the scented vapors, vapors. Oh. His eyes, his eyes close a moment as he takes a deep breath. Oh my. <laughs> he opens them. Why? I bet those, those, uh, drunk, drunk Philistines. Nice little well, Philistines. Philistine. Oh, those drunken, drunken Philistines. Philistines wouldn't know a decent, a decent wine if it was spat in their face, their faces. <laughs> he chuckles. A little bit of evil there. A little bit of yeah, yeah those Philistines. Why have those drunken Philistines wouldn't know a decent wine if it was spat in their faces, he chuckles. It's a little unseemly, isn't it? Ah, he shrugs. But the coin will be good. Aye. <laughs> he raises. What a time, he finishes taking a very, 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 very long drink from his coffee. My friends, I'm going back to the halls for now. Tom Lowe, for anything, contact me. She smiles almost melancholy. And now I don't make me own, but I hope to. Uh, he eyes... He eyes Muckler as she... As she gets up. His eyes track... Track her... Uh, <laughs> as she walks out. He looks back to Ulrich. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, <laughs> That's our land there. That's our land there for farming, friend. Eager falls. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't ban me. <laughs> and I'm sure we could arrange something like that for you, all week. The farm's got a lot of good fruit and berries there. Huge. <laughs> 
tracts of land. Yeah. <laughs> Ouch. When she walked in, I was like, a boo. A boo. Shut up. Get down. Hey. Get up. <laughs> the tongue stuck in his mouth. Dog wins. Would it be a problem for you if I keep both jobs from your farm and from the restaurant? Not a problem at all. Hells, I'm seeing an opportunity almost. Aye. Skim, skim these bleeders, bleeders in corridor dry. I say. He nods to Tom Lowe. Get my unscrupulous businessman head on. Very Rakshashar, isn't it? Oh, what about the money, eh? I just think it'd be mighty fine if Shy Farm became the new favourite winery of them fine folks down there. Maybe you'd like to be the brewer that makes it, is all. Aye, from farm... Farm to fork. Yeah, that's... And from vine... Vine to wine. To dine. From vine to wine to dine. Yes. I am familiar with the process myself, so I should uh, could certainly assist. It sounds like an amazing project. Yeah, there she is. Gas. He yells. He yells up the stairs. She'll see us on the way out, I'm sure. Ah, shrugs. Shrugs with a <coughs> smile. <coughs> How can the circle assist in this? I'm glad you like the idea, lad. Aye, with some with some clever branding, clever branding and marketing. Marketing, you can have have the mark. You can have the Cordorians. Doing backflips, backflips for farm, for farm, farm, for Shire, Shire farm, wine. What the bloody, what the? <laughs> it is a sigh of relief. Oh, it's EXO. Exodius, my beloved. Hey, he's taken. He's taken. Hands off. Just a small bit of shenaniganery from Exo is all. <laughs> he chuckles. 
the sheriff uh, sheriff has his has his ways oh no they should have appeared by now you're gonna blow up the server xl this is a fun one this one's called dream state I don't really know around half century, I'd say. Well, I say lad, but I know dwarves run older than him. How old are you, Ulrich? <clears throat> he whistles. He whistles with a look. Uh, whistles impressed. Master Ulrich, Master Ulrich fought, uh, fought off the Wolf Town. Wolf Town boys, boys. Uh, the other tribe. Like the stout lad. Ah, there you are. Ah, there you are. Smiles. Winces with an awkward, awkward look. <clears throat> ah, yes, meet uh, meet Ulrich. The lad's uh, getting uh, uh, the master dwarf. He's getting into uh, wine making. Oh yeah, we're becoming coming on to be a winemaker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. Get down! Tom, I am all in for the festival. Why? No, I could help with that. <laughs> Tom, I am all in. It's a very, very, uh, like, American sitcom business lady type speak Tom I am you know it's very if anybody watched a Bojack Horseman with uh, the the cat the cat lady who's the she's like the uh, she's like his agent yeah she'll ring someone and go oh Susan hey I am all in for getting Bojack to do the such and such and such very that kind of style yeah, I thought so. I'm going to be pushing out, uh, out a try there, so so as to not conflict with Miss Mockler's own event, he says with a nod. But yeah, glad to hear you're on board. Ah, oh, that's good too, he says with Ulrich. Aye. No. I wasn't making fun of you. You want to fight? Eh? I don't want to fight, Cass. Thank you very much. <laughs> no, thank you. She murdered that dwarf. He's scary. He's scary, man. He's scary. Oh, that's good too, he says uh, with Ulrich. I also know my way around a bit of, bit of battle. Slinger myself. Slinger. Oh. Slinger. That's with a smile. Oh, that would be amazing, ma'am. What do you need from me? How can I help? Hi. How can we help? Yeah, it's... I can produce, uh, 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 furniture and decorations from stone. Paintings, too, if you've, uh, the materials. He grins wide, bouncing about in a seat. I'll fight ya. Put him up. Put him up. Yeah, you're coming with me. I make wooden things, says Salantir. Makes wooden things hard. No, not like this. Not like this. Not like this. Hey, Studio, I need someone to man the art festival too. Uh, ah, well. I could, uh, I could be, uh, be the organizer for such. 
if you've any any existing plans uh, I'd hear them I'm not surprised I'm opening the mouth <laughs> as for festival's materials needs I'll be leaving the folks in charge of the events to determine what they'll need for the event oh fucking hell I've got to organize it then have I <clears throat> Today, precisely. Uh, how many how many trines do we have? He asks. If you can make the elven kinds, I heard the nobles fancy them. Oh, elven wines. How's it going, Dalantir? You had a good day. What have you been up to? What you been doing, huh? What you been doing, huh? What you been doing, huh? Oh, it was your birthday! Shit, dude! I forgot, I forgot, I thought it was next weekend. Happy birthday, Thalantir! Happy birthday, happy birthday! Just for you, Thalantir, we're gonna bring back an old favourite. You're lucky. You are lucky because... Nobody's here and I can do this without feeling any any guilt. Right. Uh, we used to do this all the time on the stream, but we're going to do this one just for you. Guys, if you haven't... If you haven't already, redeem that... Uh, the eels boy. Get those points now for those eels because we are about to... Find it in a trance where they can. Eels up inside ya. Find it in a trance where they can. Born for your mind, for your tummy, for your anus. Eels. 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 Small climbing over Shan, a little too close. The waves are off. <laughs> On your way, old lady. <laughs> he smirks. Loads of money. Thanks, that's a good birthday. You know that. I got loads of money. Yeah, I know that one, mate. <laughs> that's Harry Enfield. A very, very famous uh, comedian from the 80s and 90s. Uh, hey, I won't hold you up. I'm hoping to have all the details of communication done through the message board on the second floor of the farmhouse by the table, meeting table to, to enjoy. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I love that song. Oh. Might be a different song. Uh, I got loads of money. It's, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Loads of. Loads of means loads of. Hi. This is wine. Wines and dishes are, are to be savoured, savoured by all. And beans. Beans with a warm smile.
Look at that 40 XP per tick. Thick. RPR 40 pro. Have you only just seen this? Well, uh, uh, if, if the details of the art competition are to be left to me. Now I know you are 40, but it's fun to see the tick. <laughs> it's a nice little tick right there, baby, ain't it? Those don't come easy, that's all I'm going to say. Oh, glad to have someone that enjoys a cooking in charge of that event. Um... <clears throat> I suppose uh, I can... You're old and wise, you'll get it. For sure. And she's alright at roleplay as well. Not bad. Kind of... Kind of... Kind of average. Kind of... She's 20 RPR at roleplay. Which is 40 RPR at fun play. <laughs> 40 RPR Sloot Snake, 20 RPR everything else. <laughs> Sloot Snake! Speaking of Sloot Snake... What was this? Where was it? Climbing over Shan, a little too close. She's trying her tricks on me. That's all I'm going to say. Not having it. Uh, and yeah, if you want to take charge, I have some ideas of my notice about this up on the second floor of the farm. There's nothing you have to stick by. I ain't run a cart contest before. It's just that uh, I thought it sounded like a good way to organise it. I'll head that way. I'll head that way uh, uh, straight straight after this meeting. Straight after this meet. Uh, make sure I'm appraised of the details. You know, it's... I'm not drunk, I'm tired, and I write silly things, says Salantir. All right, put it away, you. <clears throat> well, friends. Here's where we're all in accord. You nuts. What are the uh, prize for the uh, competition? Any ideas on... Respect, uh, the re respect and adoration of all involved. Uh, nods with a smile, enjoying the food while listening. Something I'd like to determine, I'm happy to have the farm's funds put towards that, but I ain't sure what would be appropriate. I'll... I'll, uh, I'll have a think. Think about it. Perhaps some art... art palettes. Uh, or a trophy. Of some kind. We'll need judges as well. But we'll get around to that soon enough. Smiles. Or a voting system. Mind you, I need count. That help I slight laughter. He nods his head, ain't a bad thing at all to organise that, he says, smiling and yeah. Right, key for you, Ulrich. He hops up. He hops up. Breadcrumbs uh, spill off his plate, plate and on and onto the ground. He clicks a finger at a at a waiter at the bar at the bar at the barman. He wipes. Uh, he wipes. Buttery, buttery fingers down his plate. I don't be fine with it. You say he's dropping a key into the water basin. All 
Right, I'm gonna head head over to the farm and check that uh, notice you placed. Ulrich, good to see you. All right, let's go get that done. So I'm running the art contest now. When did he say it was? What's the real date? Date again? <laughs> Sorry. Sunday the 28th. Oh, shit. Fucking Sundays. I don't normally do Sundays. I'll go sleep before I get tempted to MW when I do something silly in character. I don't want to do an Ashan. What are you trying to say? Mr. Valentier. Get to bed. You bad boy. I hope you had fun, dude. What did you get up to? What did you play? What, uh, you said you were going to play some Magic the Gathering. What else? Did you do some tabletop or... Champion Alps? Is that the farm? 50 channel points is cheap, but I'll never stop writing in purple. It's fine. I've had it, brother. 1 p.m. EST. Uh, 1 p.m. EST in British summertime is 6 o'clock. Oh, shit. Today we did some tabletop games. Tomorrow, some MTG, more tabletop or Switch games. Wow. Are you guys playing Monster Hunter? Or. Mario Kart, maybe? This is a bit farmy, actually, isn't it? This sounds a bit farmy. Yes, thank you. Uh, I guess I'm... I guess I'm playing the game on Sunday, then. <laughs> oh, well. Wow, cardboard crack. I'm disappointed. He's also going to a tournament tomorrow to support a friend. Yes, we'll see. Have a nice stream here. Keep grinding the power. Cheers, Thalantir. I really appreciate you stopping by, brother. I hope you have a great birthday, mate. Keep it up. I'm talking about eels, boy. Eels up in Sorja. Hopefully I don't get uh, smacked on the back of the hand by the BBC for that one. No worries, mate. Love you. Kind of. A little bit. Not in that kind of way, though. Head manager Tomlo Fumpy Tom. Can I go in there? No. Oh, here we go. Here's the, the thing. Harvest Festival. Event planning over you, mop and off 20th. Shire Farms, Harvest Festival, date set, and work needed. Shire Farmstead is under new management. Okay, so we'll start with this one. Howdy, fellow farmers. This is a message addressed to all of the workers of the Shire Farm. The date for the Harvest Festival has been set. The Harvest Festival will take place on the evening of Uktar the 21st, roughly. That's uh, not right anymore. As a festival, we will, of course, need some festivities for the people to participate in. Of which I have three in mind. A cooking contest, an art contest, and a harvest brawl. What I need from you is help with preparing for these events. I would love it if someone wants to take charge of organizing one of these events, even as I know I will need help with running all of this. I will have a separate letter posted on the message board by the long table in the meeting room on the second floor of the Northern Farmhouse. I think that's what this is, right? Yeah. I will ask that we use this board to communicate with this and all matters of farm business going forward as well. Thank you all for your support thus far, and I do hope you are as excited for this as I am. Signed, Tom Lowe, Tom, Head Farm Manager. 
This is off by one. All right, here we go. Harvest Festival event planning overview, mopping off the 20th. This is a high level overview of the events that we will be having and what work will be need to be done to prepare for those events. Do not work, do not take this as a final list of events as I'm happy to have smaller fun and games to be put on. But I am looking forward, looking to keep the main event to count, the main event count to around three. Only so much time in the day after all. If you would like to take charge with organizing one of these events, please leave a message on my door. I'd be happy to see such a letter. The art contest. This is us. Fairly straightforward event. I propose we have the contest pieces on display and allow guests to vote over the course of the festival. We'll schedule a final display of the pieces and announce the winner. Maybe do an auction too. We need showman woman to direct the event. That's me. I'm going to collect the votes. Determine a staging area. A prize for the winner. More than just a blue ribbon with a pat on the back. I like having something set up that can be corrupted. So me being in charge could mean uh, an opportunity to corrupt the result. A prize for the winner, more than just a blue ribbon with a pat on the back. Oh, more than just a blue ribbon, so more than a trophy. Cooking contest, those are fairly straightforward. Uh, I don't need to bore anything to worry about that. Okay, so this is really good. Tom Lowe is, Tom Lowe, you're out there brother this is brilliant really good stuff excellent work yeah really obvious what i need to do here yeah is someone to direct the event someone to collect the votes uh, so yeah what's the shorthand tour of the farm then determine the staging area prize for the winner which is more than the blue ribbon yeah easy peasy Very nice, you have a you have good land. Oh Cassie's over there, look. points maybe I want to put a few points into furniture first off how dare you sir she chortles <clears throat> revenge is a dish best served cold <laughs> he asserts with a smile he takes up uh, he takes up a uh, a brush a brush. She uh, she dips a wick into red wax. Small candles forming along the cotton. Picks up a manual uh, and flips flips through the various the various listings of materials and diagrams. And diagrams. Let's have a look. If some, what if we had like a golem creating competition you know like a living statue that could be the prize so you get a you get a, a work of art A golem that's traced in beautiful circles. <clears throat> that could be could be a cool idea. 
And Saphir's got the uh, control stones and the hearts, right? So I could use the farm, the farm uh, stuff to buy those from him, make a golem, uh, and have that given to the uh, who? Who was it who made? Oh, it's Kaldor. Sorry, not not Saphir. It was Kaldor that has the golem making abilities and the the materials for. Uh, uh, delivering that stuff. And it's just 15 granite. 15 granite and a bit of labor, like a day's labor. His finger, yeah, he, he slams, slams the book shut. Shut and places, places it on the, uh, the easel. Uh, a satisfied, satisfied, satisfied nod. I think I've got, got an idea. For the art, art competition prize. Whispers in Draconic. <laughs> Exciting. Ah, Master Ulrich, uh, you're uh, you're settled in. Ah, the place is nice. Not an agreement. Aye, that it is. Uh, if you've uh, 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 <coughs> he nods, nods to his right. Seems, seems we have uh, all the all the uh, necessary necessary stations set up as well. I'm unsure what what. Uh, Crops, crops are crops are planted at the moment, though. At the moment, however, however, snowbirds love song harp. Oh, less. Alright, is good. We'll be able to brew and cook. So he's not necessarily raised a dwarf. He's not fluent in dwarven, which is interesting. Uh, well, well, let me keep you. Keep you. Yeah, Rakshasha moment. I've uh, I've much much to be getting on with. Good day. He smiles. <laughs> Good Sam. <laughs> uh, I'll start tending the other crops in the next trine. Have your hands full. Hands full, no doubt. Plenty of, uh, plenty of, la plenty of, uh, plenty of land to till. I have to finish my wine search before. Perhaps uh, you'd be kind enough to donate uh, a batch, a batch of wines to the art competition prize. 
Goon Sam, not to be confused with Henchman Joe. <laughs> Goon Sam, yeah. We had a Henchman Joe. He was a good henchman. Well, he was a good soldier. Very good soldier. If I have time to produce by then, sure. Oh, you'll you'll have uh, have more than a try try week uh, try week. He remarks. See you later. Have a harp set to set up for a loady. Yeah, waves down the hall. Oh, we should be fine then. I. I look forward forward to sampling. I don't care, is all I'm going to say. I'm not going to say 21, 21 days. I guess I could say 210 days, but... I say try a month, I say try a week, I say try, I say bags. I'll be back in 20 try minutes. Yes, but if I say three weeks, he might think it, it's actually three weeks in character. Yeah? And so to avoid him having to do any mental maths and figure that out, try week is an in-game week. We'll celebrate the fast fast produced here. Ho oh, ho! He smiles warmly. I cannot wait, Master Auric. Well, I uh, I need uh, need to speak with uh, with uh, Tom Lowe and uh, uh, send send out a missive for uh, for a friend. Good day and circles embrace. That's all right. Throws his arms out wide in an encompassing wave. Not sure, I'll see you around. Nothing pains me more than doing a writ, though. Shanta, Shanta's blessing. Shanta, Shante, Shanta. Doing a writ. Doing a writ. Do I come do a writ? <laughs> Even though they're called writs. Want to do writ? I've got three rich. <laughs> I make myself laugh. Why? Why do I? Why do I make myself laugh? You do that, and I watch these. I watch these vlogs back, and when I make myself laugh, I laugh when I watch them back. Like I, I don't even know if anybody finds what I'm laughing at funny. It's like <laughs> but I make myself laugh. What do I read? He's left that door open. Oh. Door red lads. <laughs> I'll get the door. Right, where's Tom Love? Is Caldor alive? Well, I just need to find a speedy messenger. Oh, don't they have one in the farmhouse? Actually, they have a a, a, a messenger in here, don't they? think they do Caldor nearly Vintergaard no Caldor check the playlist Yeah, I wish there was something more immersive or more immersive common way to call. The thing has tasked me with clearing out a crypt. Meh. There is. I usually call the individual quests, jobs or contracts. I mean, the word writ. Writ is fine. 
I don't understand what the problem with the word writ is. It's the... It's... Well, a writ... A writ is... Is a contract. Right? Like, it literally means... Well, I, yeah, I guess doing a writ means writing a writ rather than carrying out the instructions on a writ. I, I get what you're saying. Looking at the definition of the word writ. But you could say the same with I'm, I'm doing a contract. Doing, yeah, doing a document. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, let me check the Astro RLF player list. And I could do a player portal, do a search for Caldor. Must be to log in. What's all this about? Next. We'll take that one out, I think. Caldor Moonshadow is alive and playing right now, so I should be able to. Caldor Moon Shadow. Hi there. Caldor Moon Shadow. There it is. It's working now. Okay, I need a bank. Every other silly aerolithism I can justify as being local slang, like calling 1k a bag. Hello. Yeah, such such things exist. I best check this out with Tomlo, haven't I, Bert, first? Also, wow, Ishan is poor. All of my characters are poor. I don't spend time grinding, grinding coin and playing your cutesy little content. That's all I'm going to say. It's cute. It's fine. You want to go running around dungeons, killing, clicking on monsters to death. Have at it. But I, I don't do that stuff. I don't go out on Ritz, really. I roleplay. <laughs> Sorry to say. So, like, I don't have a lot of time either. That's the other thing, is I spend most of my time, but what little time I have role-playing, you know what I mean? Like, a whole, uh, a whole session for me is, like, four hours, and I'll spend that entire four hours. I might do one writ, share the money with someone, um, and then spend the rest of the time role-playing. Like we're doing right now. Uh, the other problem I've got is I can't... I can't really go out. I can't stretch my legs right now and... Uh, use all of my abilities to make money, right? If I want to use my character's abilities to make money, I need to be... I need to know when I can switch my disguise uh, when nobody's looking, and then bring out the fucking undead zombies and use Eldritch Blast and all that sort of stuff. But because eyes are on, yeah, I don't know whether it's safe to switch into a disguise or not, or to switch out of a disguise. Uh, 
Um, and so I have to be very careful. Did you not take Freelancer, though? Yes, I took Freelancer, yeah. Uh, he thumbs through the big book. No, no Tomlo. What did the grandfather clock say when the guests wouldn't eat their food? You wasted their time. Cap, I'm really sorry, but... really crap joke <laughs> it's just so bad <laughs> i'm so sorry pal but you've just not got it like you've just not got the jokes cap come on <laughs> like they just don't land pal for me i'm so sorry <laughs> keep trying though pal keep trying i really like one of these days cap's gonna bring one yeah the punchline is there it just doesn't fit the setup right yeah the grandfather clock speaking to his guests hi there Caldor moon shadow I mean, I'll be rich eventually, but I don't chase coin. I don't care about coin. Uh, what were you, uh, Caldor. Friend. Uh. Oh, oh, elf boy. Elf boy. This wee lad. Lad Ishan. Good looking fella. Quite, uh, quite the handsome, handsome him. Turn I should deliver, deliver deliver this message message unto you unto you <clears throat> ahem ahem he clears his throat Caldo, old friend uh, good friend good friend and and circles embrace do you still have that golem stone and heart for sale you don't have enough gold what oh i didn't get any gold out shit roll all that out hello like i said poor you guys are really like you've hit a nerve because ev every one of my characters is poor what am i doing wrong why ming wasn't poor was it i mean ming was poor uh but he wasn't poor when I, whenever he needed any money i could just go and make some money with him very easily he could make 10 bags in like half an hour on ming Hi there. all right let's try this again shall we <sighs> Right, hey up, elf boy. This wee lad, Ishan. Good looking fella. Quite handsome, him. Said I should deliver this message unto you. Ahem. He clears his throat. Caldo. Good friend and circles. Circles embrace. Do you still have that golem stone and heart for sale? Maybe I miss you buying a bunch of things at some point. It's the fact that I'm like five levels behind and I have so much more gold. Uh... Have you been have you been soloing have you got a full collection of transmutative potions uh, have you got 80 shield scrolls 
Whilst have you got uh have you got one of these? Uh have you got an infiltrator's belt? Uh have you got enchanted enchanted gear? It's red moon everyone playing right now. <laughs> All right. Flexing? How am I flexing? Like, I, <laughs> I've got a Lantanese ring over here. Look, it's no flex. It's just I've got some stuff. I've got mithril dust over here. I've got a rogue stone as well, sat around doing nothing. I've got tons of gems to cut and sell. Does it in this, what I call in this game, the area of getting lost forever? Oh, it's designed like that. There's a certain way of getting in and out, right? Right, I've sent the message to Kaldor so he knows that I want the golem stuff off of him. Yeah, the way of getting out is called a portal lens. <laughs> there you go. Love this song. Gone, Loke, forever in our hearts. Uh oh. Red Legion strong, sir. Death to the enemy! Ah, what get are you except whinging like a... like a milk drinker. You there, he barks. This man wishes to join the Red Legion and uh, enact justice around the town. Not in our name, he doesn't. If you don't step back, I'm going to slap you with this axe in five seconds. Get out of my face. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, to take me back. Take me back. Oh. I just want to... I just want to drop a shan right now. <laughs> Just go and log on to Scal and start screaming at people. Shall we do it? Shall we do it now? Shall we just get on to Scal and play a fucking villain? Oh, what a do. Thousand, one thousand weapons. Say at the door, she up nods to her chan. Come, come, we should we should catch up. I've got something you should hear. <sighs> Oops. <laughs> he chuckles. <laughs> Probably from Caldor, bless him. Pinches the bridge of his nose. That was probably, probably from Caldor. Uh, yeah, we should catch up, huh? Hi. One day when you're not busy, what news? What news do you bring? 
I'm not busy now. Come, come, share the news. Who's terrible at flirting? Who's flirting? Well, I ain't got much news. I pushed the number twice on accident, but now I gotta run back to the bank. <laughs> ah, dear. Uh, we saw in front of everyone. Well, so rather. What did Cam say? I just figured we ought to get to know each other or something, she says with a shrug. Hi. Well, if you should know. Uh, I've been uh, working. I've. I've just started uh, uh, work on work on the farm. Caldor's here. <laughs> Aye. And speaking of which, there. here he comes. Caldor, friend. Oh, but a moment, uh, my lady. He smiles. Little redhead kit. Uh, do you have have the heart, heart and control stone, friend? I do. Excellent. 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 I need to like uh, uh, take him to one side. Uh, would you mind uh, stepping into 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 uh, a more, more private private setting at the moment? Smiles. Uh, hmm, that's kind of weird, isn't it? Well, uh, would you mind mind bringing them? down to the basement, friend. We'll involve Cam as well. Cam, come join us. Smiles. Yeah, he, uh, he asks. He, uh, he shouts down the road. Quite rude. <laughs> we can go to the Akin Tower, I suppose. Are you tuned to the Witherstone? In a sec. Ah, sit down. Very well. <laughs> Cam's getting into trouble. So I think what I'll do is I'll get Caldor to name name the price and then I'll just double it, yeah? So that it's like, oh, I thought you meant that for each piece, not for both pieces, in case it ever comes back to bite me on the arse. My apologies, you know, I'll uh, sort out the coin. Ah, here we are. Here we are. Yes, well. <laughs> Cramped. <laughs> he chuckles. Uh, do you need a key?
It's a bit epic, isn't it? You have a key ring to secure it. That was like, what the hell? Called well, Avalanche, that one. Oh, excellent. There we go. Here we go. He uh, holds up, holds up the key for Kaldor. Right. Well, uh, so I've been tasked with uh, taking control of the the art competition for an upcoming festival uh, at uh, at the Shire Farm. Hi, please do. Uh, and so uh, I'm tasked tasked with providing a prize. I was thinking uh, a stone golem fashioned by my hands would serve would serve as a prize uh, for whomever whomever wins. He, he nods. The uh, the farm owner has said. He'd be happy, happy to uh, assign farm funds uh, to pay, pay for, for any prize. So you need only, only name your price, and uh, he'll pay. He nods. <laughs> Ish. <laughs> Hopefully. let my greed get the better of me here and like really really ring ring a bunch of coin out of Tom Lowe. might be a good idea it's like oh I will let let a sham the lawful evil Rakshashar run the art competition it's like we can't try and squeeze some coin out of it you know what I mean for our for our own uh, gain <clears throat> I suppose I would have to ask for 20 bags to cover what I paid for them. So be it. So be it. Uh, do you need the coin right now, or are you happy to take a transfer later? Smiles up. You can hold on. Hold on to the, uh, the stone and heart. Uh, though I like to have have them in my care uh, in case uh, anything should should happen to you you could buy a new golem for 30 I think though I can fashion fashion a golem myself uh, myself though I need uh, you could buy a new golem for 30 I think though uh, you're selling selling them selling them Sure, I don't use them often. I only brought them out when we were together for fun. More or less. If I take them, well, 
Uh, now I'll... Uh, I would need to uh, fashion fashion something uh, myself. I would need to fashion something myself. Uh, something special. Something special to commemorate. 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 Commemorate the occasion. Uh... Uh, I hope you don't find uh, uh, not quite as strong but easier on the eyes. I see, of course. You could do one. Well, I'll leave the control stone and heart in your storage here. Excellent. I'll procure procure granite, procure granite, and have it shaved, and a transfer will be fine. Twenty bags, I. Eh? Oh. Uh, he nods. He nods. He nods with a pleased manner. All right, I'll speak. Speak with Tom Lowe. Uh, leave leave the matter with me. Uh, the uh, the prize. You can animate it yourself. Nay, I'll need I'll need your your hands to do such. If that's all right. You know of a place where this can be achieved? Might be worth just buying the two. Not a problem, it's, which is why I asked. And I do not, though I found an arcane tower near Cordo I have not fully investigated yet. Oh, will they have column making at the arcane tower? Ah, yes. Well, your mission. Uh, well, I've I've two requests. Requests of you, if you would. I suspect there to be a crafting station there. Firstly, find out, find out, uh, uh, yeah, if there's uh, a golemancy. Golomancy lab. Lab anywhere in the aisle. That tower sounds like the first place you should check. He nods. Secondly, I'd hear... Hear of any news... Uh, from Mayon. Specifically regarding... Regarding uh, our circle. Uh, any news from Mayon? Rather than talking about the circle. Yes, working on that already. I'd hear of any news from Mayon. Uh, how are your affairs, affairs there getting along? Rosalina. Not much to tell. <clears throat> Are you making any efforts uh, to involve involve yourselves yourself in uh, in their official official business out there? Perhaps as a as an administrator. Of the government, or a guard, perhaps. Still roaming and sticking to the woods mostly. I only visit the banks and shops. I hear no news, really. Oh. Well, 
perhaps uh, it'd be it'd be good for you to uh, uh, to push push yourself and be ambitious, friend. Cass, for example, uh, has has taken residence at Tomlo Tomlo's farm, and is working there, working there. Oi! She thumps the door. <laughs> Come in, come in. <laughs> come. Have you? I was being accused of something I don't remember doing. Probably means I did it, yeah. He <laughs> chuckles. Uh, Cam, uh, this is uh, Caldor. Uh, we were just we were just talking talking about about ambitions. I don't remember anything of the sort. He's been uh, frequenting. He's been frequenting my own. Uh, but is yet uh, yet to find his place amongst his people. <clears throat> and to answer answer your question, Caldor, my my application is still under review. But in the meantime, I've an art competition to uh, to organise. A gaze wanders about the room. How about you, Cam? How are you settling in? <laughs> settling in, he states, he asks, uh, with a wry grin. <laughs> Any plans to, uh, ah, well, well enough, all things considered. Have you thought about uh, applying for the Hawking, perhaps? Or for a position uh, as retainer with uh, the mayor? Quite, I don't remember her name, is it Kaylee something or other? Katie, whatchamacallit? It's something. A local militia? Nah, I'm good. Yeah. Nah, I'm good, eh? Uh, uh, what of uh, Brogendenstein? Brogendenstein. What about uh, applying for work there? My cake! Shakes her head. I've hardly stepped foot in the place. Ah. <sighs> Felt a bit intimidating, to be honest. Oh, come now. You're capable. You're you're uh, you're a capable, capable, capable writ worker. I'm gonna say writ doer. Smiles. I'm sure you'd you'd be a, a fine fine fit for something something official. There is a home available there in the Hall of Legends. Aye, I do. Nuts. Our circle has much much to offer to to all corners corners of Ireland. I know because I thought I bought it, thought about moving in before I realised the problems it could present. I'm happy to just do wait for the adventures registry for now. I mean, not. 
Let's see, that's the cat. That's all well. Aye, I suppose the dwarves... The dwarves wouldn't be happy about uh, an elf living in their halls. He uh, turns to Caldor. He shuffles by, sneaking through the bookshelf. What's that dark book? He offers Cam, Cam a, a, a dusty tome. Treaties on on the separation separation of satyrs in the woods. He smirks. Probably not Ishan. It is a huge hole. She leans against the barrel, skimming through the book. Probably not Ishan. It is a huge hole, though, more than enough for a base for the circle. If you wanted to buy it, they would likely accept a halfling, especially lately. Oh, that's fine. That's fine, uh, Caldor. We have we have a cottage on the farm now but uh, I thank you for your uh, continue, continued efforts this room this room is situated situated right in the centre centre of Bendir of Bendir and we have the cottage for the uh, for the room should we have need news oh, I was just trying to pawn it off on you <laughs> given but given this news <laughs> he chuckles but uh, given the news uh, given the little given the lack lack of news out of my own uh, I would ask ask of you ask of you to take up take up the mantle as circles representative representative in my own She mumbles to herself, what's this got to do with satires? He lifts his arm up. He lifts his arm up a moment, a moment. And makes a banging sound. And turns, turns back to, back to Caldor. then I was just trying to point it off on you but given the lack of news out of my own I would ask you to take up the mantle of circles representative in my own uh, you needn't uh, uh, introduce yourself as uh, in any official capacity capacity if you if you don't wish oh, of course Ishan I must get back to Cordor for now though investigate that tower uh, uh, if you don't wish uh, but I would, I would enjoy hearing of of the affairs there. Uh, if you could, could involve yourself, um, uh, we'd be uh, our circle would be would have uh, would be covering uh, another area of the aisle, thanks to your efforts. Hi. Please do, uh, Caldor. He, he waves to the door. You have a key. You may, may, may see yourself out, friend. Smiles. He throws his arms, arms out wide, in an encompassing wave. Circles embrace, friend.
keep up the great work great work and i'll have your your bag sent soon Sates, sates your needs. He takes a ponderous tone. Uh. Hold on, I'll hold on to it, I guess. <laughs> How's the circle being there? Eh? Well enough. We've uh <coughs> we've been dealing uh with uh Maganes. Mm, well enough. Miles. Yeah, holds out. Holds out a bag. Uh, what of these wares? Uh, Cam, anything you'd like to take a pick from? these robes he pulls out pulls out a uh, set of satin satin uh, satin sa uh, a lump lump of satin holds a finger to his lips Yeah, he offers the uh, the robes. <clears throat> Local business progresses well. Progresses well. We've uh, we've suffered suffered Maganes Maganes lies well enough. Cass has taken, taken, taken to the farm with El and Theron. Uh, my work joining the Hawking uh, is underway. Are you thinking about starting a new character? No.
<sighs> Aye, these boots. He uh, reopens, reopens the bag. This, uh, this lovely, lovely gem hammer. We're gathering, gathering uh, the fine, fine stones out in the cave systems, systems to the north. though those cave systems are filled with many eyes he waves his arms out wide one foot wrong and monsters will set upon you Bravery and dealing dealing with the satires uh, did not go on remarked. Oh, is this online? Yes, it is retro gaming Denmark. It's uh, this is Arilef, uh the online persistent world. Uh, it's a roleplay server, so uh, me and these two cats. This is me here. I'm playing Ashan Pajar, the head of a cult, and uh, we're just letting this character, Chamomile, kind of in on things, but we can't say too much because we might be being spied on, um, and so we're having to be very careful about what we say. In case, uh, she gives a slow nod. I'm surprised you even remember. You stand here, you stand here with us today. Uh, today. Camp. <clears throat> the machinations of Maganair and... The machinations, uh... Our move to the aisle has kept me rather, rather busy. Rather busy. And unable to uh, uh, speak with you in the right sense. Give it time. We'll, we'll get acquainted. Acquainted. Acquainted properly. He smiles. Jeff is a smirk in return. <clears throat> but regarding your Get back to me when you're ready, yeah? Soon. However, I would ask you to reconsider your position as writ worker. Writ worker and only writ worker. I have the game for Switch, PS4, and Xbox Series X. I doubt many are playing those online, though. Uh, I think you can join RLF on, on those. It's not like a co-op game, uh, retro. It's uh, it's more like an MMO. So, if you can join the RLF server, there's uh, there's thousands of people play on RLF each day. I ain't one for politics, you admit, but I'll think of something. 
Our circle is is spreading spreading far far and wide. Uh, there's opportunities. Opportunities uh, to be taken all over the aisle. I would only ask uh, you to uh, report report whatever whatever fun you get up to from time to time. He smiles. <clears throat> Perhaps you could be rewarded. Rewarded with many more books. He smiles. Or some other pleasure you seek. Or what is our circle, if not a support network, to help you get what you wish? He licks his lips. Ah. <clears throat> Think on it, long and hard, friend Cam. He throws his arms out wide and, and speaks in a stern tone. Circles embrace, friend Cam. <laughs> Hi, please do. Now it's it's getting rather late, rather late, and I'm due. Uh, I'm well well past my due due nap time. <laughs> Chuckles. I I'll get you one. A uh, uh, key ring. Yeah, uh, hands over a key. Take care with it. He smiles. Think on my words of encouragement. You've you've uh, much, much, uh, much to offer in these lands, Cam. Cam, do not rest on your laurels. And be ambitious. I like this. It's, uh, all of a sudden, it's like just clicked for me. Like these are the sorts of conversations I've wanted to have for a long time, where the circle is supposed to be this like encouraging you to do better. And now it's like, okay, yes, we should be pushing people into positions of power and government and encouraging them to join the guard or to get into administrations or to get a job on a farm somewhere so that they can bring all of that together as part of a, you know, an information, information network. Oh, well, let me keep you. He smiles. I'll see if I can make a name for myself here, she says with a knowing smile. I'm sure you'll do great. Great things. Alright, Wink. Good day to you. He yawns. <laughs> right. I owe Caldor. A 
<laughs> I'm so sorry, Perplexia. I'm so sorry. I know you've been on the sidelines for so long. I am so sorry. You have been very patient. You really have. It's just taken me a long time to sort of fall into that, like, oh, that's how we're going to do this, you know? <clears throat> it's the push, push people to get into those different jobs and different roles and that sort of stuff so that they can spy. <laughs> that's what this is about, spying on people. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and what this means is now we can, we can have, uh, those like... What have you been up to? What, what have you seen? Uh, and we can also have the, uh, not necessarily some dark initiation for, uh, for, for Cam, but, well, we don't know what she wants, really, do we? We know she's dark and twisted. She knows we're dark and twisted. So it's just a case of, uh, building it up from here now. Well, at least she's got something to do. That's the main thing, right? It's... Yeah. It's just waiting for that, uh... The ability to ward. I've just got to get that level up, basically. We're... Closing in on 23. I need to be, what? Is it 26 before you get a Lore Master gift? Three level three of Law Master. Either way, this has been an absolute marathon, and all of those coffee and all that caffeine that I had earlier is starting to kick in now, and it's just turning 1 a.m. So <laughs> I'm gonna be up for a few a few more hours. But there are other ways to prevent scrying, supposedly. Uh, sure, but I can't discuss them in game because I might be being scried, other unless I've got Cass with me. Um, I know that you can get those mirrors and all that sort of stuff to detect when you're being scried and stuff. Uh, but those aren't foolproof. They break, don't they? What was the other one? Oh, that's it, yeah. Uh, we're gonna go see who's online playing Neverwinter right now. Retro, thank you so much for stopping by and asking us about what's going on. I really appreciate it. Um, ladies and gents, if you haven't already, consider hitting the follow button if you enjoyed this stream. There will be more. There will, we will be on again tomorrow for another big marathon stream. Because uh, I can pretty much do what I want at the moment. I'm free, as it were. No curfew and no judgy eyes. I could be a, a degenerate gamer, at least for a weekend. For a week, actually. Um, if you haven't already, consider here joining the Discord. Here is the Discord link. Come on over. If you're watching this on YouTube, come and join us live. We usually go live around about 7 p.m. Uh, UK time. Uh, follow the link in the description. Otherwise, guys, I will see you later, and I'm going to pass you over to Mr. Crispy Raven, who is currently playing Nate. So, Raiders at the ready. It's been an absolute pleasure. Uh, it's, it, fe it feels old school today. Like, we've had proper put some hours in today. I've got a whole bunch of things done. Did I get some Ritz done? Ritz done. Role play, met some people, didn't feel rushed, we finally got Perplexia in, like, oh, maybe I should do seven hours every time, eh? Uh, 
take care guys have a great one and i'll see you all tomorrow bye bye